Hola. Hi. Hola. Hola. Hey, yeah. So, oh, wait, hey, guys. We can't say uh, that. That's racist. We can't? Can we not say oh. that? Hi. No, it's okay. Hello. Oh, wait. No. Hello. All right, guys. So, uh, <laughs> welcome to checking in uh, with, uh, obviously, the Bar Checks. Today's special guest is Miguel from Always Evolving yeah, yeah. Pythons. Yeah. There's so much, uh, you know, gosh, it's good to have you back, by the way. Oh, no, thank welcome you. Welcome back. Yeah, welcome back. So, uh, it, it, so, obviously, Miguel's a dear friend of mine. We hang out. We haven't hung out in a while, man. You got too busy for me. That's I did cool. get too busy. To yeah. me, the, we, we're going to talk about who's cool in this this group right here you know what i mean i'm cool as a Ew. cucumber let me baby. let's let's get a raise of hands of anyone that has hung out with ozzy osbourne oh shit i guess i'm <laughs> the only one that's not cool oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. it was you ah uh, yeah. yeah man no so there's so much to talk about i mean it's uh again it's good to have you back you're in town for a couple of days we're going to be doing yeah. some some cool videos we're going to be hanging out and then of course uh you head off to tinley park the Maybe. NARB i might stuff. just stay here might just hang out yeah. here. It's way better to be I, totally honest more. with you. Oh, yeah. that, that's okay. No, no. Tinley, Tinley <laughs> is great, man. You know, minus Corona, but we won't talk. Lori won't let me talk about Corona tonight. So I know, right? Don't make me get. Yeah. To, I'm gonna cut you. The off only Corona the that we're gonna be talking about is Miguel's uh, abuse of Corona the beer. Dude, I abused him last night at the airport. That's what I heard. Yeah. <laughs> I so saw you, that. you know, I travel a lot, right? Yeah. And yeah. When I was at the airport, dude, I've never have I gone through like TSA so quick. And honestly, I mean, there was it was a ghost town there. I yeah. looked at my store. I'm like, wow, man. It's yeah, insane. I saw it on your story where it was and like that's empty. LAX. That's LAX. Yeah. I had a crazy. question about that. So, what time was your flight? At uh, 10, 10, 15. Yeah. 10 yeah, California yeah, the, time. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, so it's like one in the morning. Yeah, because yeah. that's what I was wondering. You said you, he was getting in so early. Well, we've I didn't taken know that red eye. Well, I don't know if we've time taken the red eye. That's Is like, it? dude, it's packed. Oh yeah, that dude, time. I I've taken a ton of L I L A uh, red eyes, and they're it's like you can't even sit down, dude. I don't, okay. Like yeah, yeah. like the every bars are open, taken. everything, yeah. man, it's crazy. Yeah, you, we've done it. So you were the only yeah, one there. Yeah. Yeah, and well, you just drank the bar clean. No, check it. I really did. So I'm talking to this guy, <laughs> and I'm hearing them talk because I, I obviously grabbed the Corona because I wanted to do it on purpose oh, for my yeah. story. And they were saying how so in Florida, all the spring breakers, like it's spring breaks for them right now. Right. Yeah, and they're, they usually fly in around this time. He's been at this at the bar, you know, in right. Delta for you know five years, mm -hmm. and he says never been this dead because no yeah. one's allowed to come here or nobody wants to even travel anymore. Yeah, no, it's crazy. But yeah. we're not allowed to talk about that because Lori's sick of it. Oh, She's yeah. sick That's of it. Right. I'm kind of obsessed on it to be honest with you. So Jay, Jay knows. The truth is, is that something no, Lori that Lori knows too. Well, I know Lori knows too. too. But something <laughs> yeah. that uh, I, I, Jay was surprised to hear about this. I actually have an obsession with pandemics. Like I studied like a ton of Ebola stuff, and I, I, I mean, I'm really <laughs> interested in it. So this is the first pandemic that we've ever had in my lifetime. Well, wait, 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 whoa, 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 Ebola. That was well, that wasn't a pandemic time, though. That's though. not a pandemic because it never it didn't spread, <clears throat> right? SARS? So no, that wasn't oh, a yeah, pandemic SARS, either. You know, the World Health Organization announced today that it's a global <laughs> pandemic. This no. is the first real global <laughs> pandemic we've had mm. in in you know since the since early nineteen hundreds. Yeah, the early nineteen hundreds. So, anyways. Uh, we're not going to talk about that. I was just getting so into while looking at you like speak. Yeah, well, we want to talk about, <laughs> we want to talk about all kinds of different Ebola uh, strains if you yeah. like. But uh, oh. anyways, point is, there's chipper things to talk about today. As such. As like? such. Like? Did I tell you guys the last day that Noah was with me at my house? Yeah, <laughs> we're no, oh, no, I'm just joking. So, joking. so joking. Noah we actually, no, no, no. so Noah actually went out to Miguel's place. Yeah, yeah it's about like six months ago, something like that. Yeah, it was something like that. Yeah. 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 And all I know is, is he came back and he was, he's never been the same. Never, dude. I'm not gonna <laughs> lie. I got so worried, man. I mean, like, I, I can't really get into depth what happened. Right. We were watching, he's we were bad. watching the football game. Oh no! And he no. starts. I mean, he started turning yellow oh and all i hear him say is dude i think i'm gonna throw that's the last we heard really that's the last we really? saw oh see listen. i didn't hear about as this as soon as noah oh. says that like it's happening yeah, it's not time, not happening he's been noah. like so good if about he feels things. sick no, yeah it's listen we ate so many freaking wings <laughs> Oh my God! Yeah, the toilet was buffalo oh, color. Yeah, gross. oh buffalo my God! Was it color. stained for weeks? So, probably. It was, it <laughs> wasn't it was my toilet. <laughs> yeah, that's true. You're gonna that's have to true. ask somebody else. <laughs> but it was so bad, though, man. I didn't think he was gonna make it the next time. Like, dude, oh why don't you just gosh. get another flight? But no, he, you know, take it like He's a, a trooper. Right? He's yeah. a trooper. Yeah. Our our boy, uh, uh, Mike Jeweler guy, said, uh, "I don't believe the big baller Miguel Money likes." Wait, what's he that? Said he does. Can you, Do you want me to read that? Yeah, please, because I can't read. I'm a little dyslexic. I am a little. Dyslexic. So I'm I, dyslexic. I start, you can't I am, steal though, that seriously. from me. That jewelry oh, guy. No, I, you got it from me is what <laughs> so happened. So you can't see. I just can't read. So Yeah, <laughs> see, I, yeah that's my problem. Okay, go ahead. He said that he doesn't have that big baller money like Miguel. 
Oh, wait, what? But he's oh, sad no, he's missing yeah. this weekend. Oh, yeah, that's right, because you dropped like 300 bucks on the, the nursery. You know, I've got to tell you, last I'm a little sentence. upset. Read the last sentence. My work even uh, got, got canceled. canceled oh, no nurses. way. Wow. Uh, I am a little bit, little bit hurt, though, because uh, I was on Kevin's uh, podcast from Nerd. Yeah. And Miguel dropped like 300 bucks on Super Chat. <laughs> I actually and have... you know, I don't think Miguel's even watched no. one of our, our freaking things, <laughs> I, let alone dropped and, any so money is this, on yeah, it. What's this called again? No, I'm just joking. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah, like, yeah. I will <laughs> say this, though. Like, no, like with, when I saw you on there, the only reason yeah. I did it is because you were there. Right. You know, yeah, I mean, sure. sure. No, for real. <laughs> A big shout out to Nerd, too. Yeah, big shout out to Nerd. Kevin's love the best. Kevin. Those guys. Love you. Not, not, not Donnie, though. No, oh, God. No, 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 no big shout out yeah. to all of you. Yeah, guys. We don't want to start anything no, with joking, these guys. I'm joking. Um, so let's see, real quick. Uh, Sharon, again, you are always great. Uh, Galaxy Reptiles. Uh, you big dog. <laughs> He's a great uh, bull ride, bud. Great bull ride. That bull ride. Let's, let's just jump right into that really yeah. quick. So I listen, I, I, you were out in at Texas, the Arlington, Arlington show. Yeah. And literally, as I think you actually texted me on the way saying, hey, I'm going to go ride a bull. Yeah, and yeah. I think my response was, like you're, you're, no, go, you're an idiot. Stu- yeah, no, you're, you're, you're an idiot. idiot. I, have it. I was like, oh, <laughs> great motivation, Brian. <laughs> great motivation. Yeah, no, and that's true. Though. I knew it wasn't going to end well. So tell us what happened. Okay, so you'd be surprised. So it was oh, Thursday. No, I won't. It was no, I won't. it was Thursday night, and I was drinking. Oh, and yeah, you know, I, I kind of figured that's right? how it started. It right? really <laughs> did. And, and then you know, um, uh, uh, JT from uh, the Reptile guy, he calls me. He's like, "Hey, man, you're gonna come on down." He goes, "I'm like, yeah." Dude. I'm like, "Do you know anyone that's gonna, you know, could teach me how to bull ride and something like that?" <laughs> and he's all, so you just pulled this. Yeah, it was, was your idea. idea. Yeah. Oh, it yeah. was your idea. And then I honestly, you know, wow. I wanted to sound cool, you know, be like, "Yeah, oh, you sure. know, this guy's yeah. a Texan," you know. So he, dude, he's like, uh, "I don't know, man." Dude, 15 minutes pass by. I get a call from freaking. Uh, from Heidi and Jack, and they're like, "Hey man, we got you set up Sunday. They're gonna oh. like open up for you." <laughs> and I was like, oh, crap. "I started sweating." I'm like, yeah, "Dude, yeah. sweating." You didn't really fog. think this through? No, yeah, I, I really did it. So I call. I'm like, "Okay, what did I get myself into?" I call all my friends. I'm like, "Okay, I'm doing this. You guys have to do it." So as the day goes by, Friday again, we're drinking again. I'm like, "Yeah, whatever." Oh, Saturday, man. we're drinking again. Yeah, whatever. Sunday came, dude. Our energy was gone. I'm not gonna lie, dude. I was afraid. Oh, so that's, uh, the, that, that's it was. So it was is, the energy was the real, problem. Wait yeah. a second. This is a real bull. Oh, this or is a real. No, bull? this is a fucking no, no, real, a real bull. bull. No, this is so real. A real bull. Like, yeah. like yeah. you see I'm on not gonna TV, lie. like the Broncos. The ones the professionals like, yes. ride. I broke a record. I did like ten. Of how many? Yeah, how many ribs? How many ribs you broke? I broke number ten and I fractured eleven. But it's so it's so embarrassing that I didn't even land on that side. I landed on on my right side, but, but the compression of just I, I'm, I, dude, I landed like a sack of potatoes. Yeah, I, I saw that. Dude, I saw that. It's been so long since so I've got the air knocked out of me, and yeah. it was just like, oh. But it lasted like, dude, like five minutes. Oh, but the dude. crazy thing. So though, you rode for like five minutes? No, no, he rode it for two. You know, it not even matter. Like, no, no, it was no, like not even it was curious. legit. Okay. Let me let me let me just show. I do you have that? Do you have that in? And can you go on to Miguel's Instagram? Do you have that posted or no? The, this is because, no, I'm not gonna post okay, it. That's horrible. It's literally, uh, you sent me this thing, and I'm not. I don't know that the bull actually left the gate before no, you no, fell off. No, shut the hell up! You no. fell off in the gate. No, no, no. no. He, and he, that's he did how ride you broke like, your ribs on the gate. There he is, right there. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that's all you're getting. You were like, that's all you're getting. You it was like just like side saddle. I, he didn't. Yeah. He didn't try to hang on. No, He's I just like, how can I get off this damn bull right now? Sideways. Okay, I'll tell you the truth. I will tell you the truth. Okay, so you know, so they're giving you all these, you know techniques of what to do yeah. and I'm like oh, yeah yeah but once you get on the bull and they're like strapping you on and you feel the power of that animal oh that my beast, gosh dude dude you just get like totally like mind you're like get like, me off this yeah thing, i was like you're i think how do i get off and not get yeah, hurt is what you're yeah thinking. and i remember my bu- my buddy uh will he's like looking at me he's like hey man how you feeling like i want to tell him like dude don't record me no more you yeah. can see it in my face yeah yeah, yeah. So this you was did like, look scared oh dude i was beyond scared he's like all i saw was his back <laughs> you're feeling like the power of this thing, and all I can think oh, of is just open the door so I could fall. Open the door so I could fm- fall. <laughs> <laughs> so they opened it, and dude, I mean, right when I turned to the side, dude, that was all she wrote. Well, you man. know what was funny was that I saw your, I think you sent me a thing saying you're going to ride a bull, and then someone else tagged you, like of someone riding. Like mm. I saw you in the helmet, right. and then someone like riding hardcore, like yeah. woo, woo, woo. Yeah, and yeah. I was like, man, he freaking's a baller, man. Yeah. Miguel Moses, El Toro, <laughs> you know? And, uh, <laughs> that wasn't me. Though. And then then I saw that, I was like, wait a second, that was not Miguel. Well, Legit, it was like a six second you yeah. know, ride, like, you know, like, ooh, and I was like, oh my God, Miguel knows wish. what he's doing. So when you were doing that and like talking about it, me and my dad, we were, yeah, talking, we were talking about it and we were 
were saying how you guys want to try it? How dumb no. it was. <laughs> yeah, we were saying that. And yeah. how dumb you were. No. <laughs> no, no and, <laughs> biggest regret. Biggest regret. And we were saying like there is no way to come out of it without an injury. Yeah, that's exactly what I said. Well, I said there's no way he's leaving without broken bones. Well, yeah, maybe. Because. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> yeah, I was right. Yeah, I was you right. probably came yeah. out of it the best you could. Yeah, you could have been. You could have broke your neck. Did Dude. others do it besides yes. you? Did oh, they wow. get hurt as well? Yes. A broken <laughs> hip. Um, oh, my a barrows a, a got hip? stepped on. Oh, <laughs> no, God. that's See, what we that's were talking about. That's my fear, yeah. exactly, is we, falling off and getting hurt by the bulls yeah. stomping it was, it was It was bad, but I'll tell you this right now. Mm. I feel so defeated, and I'm going to go back and do it again. I'm Are just going to train for it? it this time. Yeah. Shut uh, up. I didn't train. See, that's exactly well, of course what you I did. feel like. Okay, you drank you beer for three runs, days. Know what you're doing. Thank that you. That way that you have it. Honestly, I wouldn't mind. Go back. And my wife is listening right now. because she's telling me. Tina told you, man. See, Lori says I should do it again. See, Matt, you're always keeping me from doing cool stuff. Okay. <laughs> this is what yeah, you can do. Yeah, she's she's a <laughs> go, I mean, I know you like to drink and stuff. So you go back <laughs> So go to Saddle Ranch and just practice at Saddle Ranch for like no, days. I, I you know, Saddle Ranch Saddle actually Ranch. it's dangerous for your back. I had a back surgery and the, uh, the, the motion of that, I need it like uh, raw. If you Oh, you no, need it raw. If you had a back surgery, yeah. yeah. like, like, I've heard that about you. I've heard that about you. It's going to be dangerous <laughs> if you've had back surgery. No, but it's different though cuz I kind of no, knew what not. I was doing. With, yeah. with saddle ranch, it's like the motions, like back and forth, back and forth. With like anything, yeah. so if you've got well, bad isn't it? Problems, wouldn't it be kind of like a, a you know when you're drinking and you get into a car accident, you don't get hurt. Maybe if you just get plowed Honestly, before you do it, because you're plowed. much more yeah. like limber yeah. and like yeah. yeah. And then when you fall, you're just limp, you know loose. Well, so I, you're I, I, limp, raw, and plowed <laughs> right now. <laughs> this is Jesus yes. Christ. This podcast this started bull ride great, sounds <laughs> very very raw. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, but you know, so they they were telling us don't drink, don't. Drink. But at really? this point, I got uh, so nervous that we stopped by a store and I grabbed a tall can, just completely slammed it. Wow. But the only problem, my <laughs> my nerves were so in me, like it didn't, it didn't even yeah, like no. affect me at all. I, I tell you, I like doing crazy stuff, but that, I no, wouldn't do that. Go <laughs> no, well, no, I like no, doing animals. Don't. No, 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 you I like the doing... most cautious person yeah. when it comes to life. Not well, that with type animals, of stuff. No, with, animal stuff. That's life. what I'm saying. With animal stuff, I typically <laughs> really love doing stuff, but I wouldn't do that bull. Hell no. You know? Even riding a camel was scary. You know, okay. it was scary. <laughs> I don't even know what to say, right? I mean, no, so true. basically, uh, Brian's not an adrenaline junkie. No, okay. no I am not, not an adrenaline all. junkie at no. all. Dude, I don't like that shit. You took your Lambo out and went 30 miles oh, an no, hour. No, 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 no. Let's did. tell the story right. The Lambo, I got okay. to 72. 72, and what yeah, I get? 72. 130. Uh, oh, I don't know. Like yeah. 130. You and your mom. 130, yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Like him and I. Did you ever hear the, the story? Corvette. Did you ever hear the story of Lori in the Corvette? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You told yeah. me about that. Yeah. yeah. He yeah. was literally 162. crying. No. Well, yeah, with that was him yeah, in the with car. Me in it, yeah. We're just going down the street. He's like, stop, 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 slow down. And well, you I were doing up, almost 100. No, I wasn't. I wasn't even at 80. And I was like, I do faster than this in my car <laughs> on the freeway. Well, and you're like, yo, no, slow down. The slow down. are really fast. Yeah. Speak and then he got out. Yeah, he and got I, I got went. out and then she did one sixty two in a forty five mile an hour zone. Hell yeah. It was awesome. Dude, that is awesome. It was, awesome. was, awesome. It was awesome. messed up. Uh, let me catch up real quick awesome. here. We've got Nick says, uh, hey, um, want to say I absolutely love the banana city that was featured on the BHB Instagram on January seventh. Awesome. They're really cool. Heavenly knee heavenly uh, knees. Heavenly knees. Heavenly knees. Heavenly knees. Uh, yes. my girl knees. It's actually <laughs> heavenly ness, but it's I call her heavenly knees. knees. Uh, oh, guys, it is, good huh? to see you. You always make my day. Heavenly, you Thank make you. our day every single time. Michelle, hey Michelle, what's going on? She's oh, coming I like up. Michelle. On, yeah, Michelle's, Michelle's awesome, great. Dude. Yeah, she's coming up. Yeah. On, uh, I think it's July 8th through the 12th. Um, Kirsten said, can't wait to come out for my anniversary. Hey, Please, thank you so Kirsten, much. Kirsten, make sure you bring that hand sanitizer, okay? Yeah. We got plenty. That, we got plenty. That? Don't worry. You know what I mean? Because I'm not shaking any hands. You we know, got, I, this is we got we got to come up. This is good, man. We got to come up with like a uh, universal exactly handshake we for the it. weekend, right? Mm -hmm. A universal handshake that's not actual connection. Yeah, it's like what about air knuckles? Yeah, I think I think they were doing like the the elbow. Bump. No, that's too that's wimp. stupid. Yeah. That's, that's too dumb. white. Yeah, it's too white. <laughs> gotta, Way too white. Yeah, I don't know white. what you can yeah. do. Fits you guys. 
Yeah, just not me. I am white. I am really white. Like I feel like you might be whiter than us. I honestly would probably yeah, I'm not even gonna lie. I am, I am drinking some of the ultra. You're like we had a guy that was a Filipino that worked for us and we you know, he called himself a coconut. Because said brown on the outside, white, and white on the inside. Yeah, oh. I'm kind of like yeah, a coconut. coconut. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I'm surprised you, you don't have some white claws or something. Oh my god, they're oh, amazing. Claws. You want to go? <laughs> show, I'll grab a six pack if you want to go have fun. <laughs> He's like a teenage white girl. <laughs> right. You know, so, go ahead. No, nothing, nothing. Yeah. So, so regardless, you know, Miguel, uh, we we actually, ironically enough, met at the. Uh, was it Pomona or was it? It was it was a a, a, a it was, fair. Yeah, it a, was an I animal think it was fair. The Repticon, the, and the fair. No, yeah. Well, the Repticon was in the actual like animal. Because they had like the fair, cats. Because yeah. you were doing the uh, kitty litter. Yeah, thing. we were doing the kitty litter. Yeah, and, and reptile prime thing. Yeah. <laughs> Back in the kitty litter days. Back in the kitty litter <laughs> that days. That was what three years ago, right? Yeah, it was a few years. Yeah, more than that, maybe. No, but hey, <clears throat> yeah. So regardless, so you're a reptile guy. <laughs> no, uh, turn no. you know, kind of social media guy, <laughs> stuff like that. So it's an interesting thing because uh, I think it, it is one of those things where it's almost like be careful what you wish for. When we first met, you wanted to do vlogging. You wanted to kind of grow your social following. Yeah. And, and then, so how's that going for yeah, you? Yeah, so how's that going for you, dude? It's so busy, man. It's so hard. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, it's it's. But you know, I'm blessed, honestly. You know, like it's it's yeah. really really cool. And you know, again, not to you know, brown nose Lori, but yeah. I do owe it all to Brian. Do you no, even, Lori? Do you even know how I, know. I got into this? Do you know at all, like how I got into the whole like snakes well, and the whole social media part? I think you part? were at a fair looking for kitty litter, no. and kitty you litter. met Brian. No, no. okay. I was daughter, actually your daughter, right? Yeah, yeah I was yeah. actually just at home, and my daughter was eight years old. She came in running. She goes, "Dad, look, look, look at these snakes." And I remember you were it was you were showing like uh, a bell and a pie. She was pie. watching YouTube. Yeah, yeah, and I was like, YouTube. "Wow, ball pythons!" Like I didn't even know. I just remember normals and albinos. So she's like, "Dad, can we get a couple snakes?" I was like, "Oh, right, cool." And I remember just watching. I was like, "Oh, cool." So you know, I remember the time I was at work. <laughs> On my break, I'd go and I'd watch your stuff. And then after that, um, my my daughter's like, you know, can you start a YouTube channel for me? I was like, yeah, sure. So we did it in two weeks. You could care <laughs> less him. about it. Look at him, like now, best dad ever. Yeah. Like, dad, can we get snakes? Sure. Yeah, start yeah, a YouTube channel. Yeah, now it's a business. Sure. Now he's got a big yeah. business. Going. Now it's yeah. a full business, you yeah. know. And it's honestly takes about like seventy to eighty percent of like my yeah, work right now. This whole like so Aubrey better have fifty percent of the company. Yeah, because she's it's 10%. all her fault. She's in trouble right now. Ten oh, percent. So yeah. yeah. Speaking of that, I saw that uh, Ace actually was in a video Dude. the other day, huh? Yeah, it was so cool. So um, the guys uh, from uh, from Phase, yeah, mm -hmm. called me like, "Hey man, like, we need your son for like you know a music video. You know, it's gonna be it's a really cool song, you know." So yeah. it's like, "Yeah, cool." So he went over and he got paid for it too. Oh, like, it, like, it went like like legit, man. Yeah. Like, yeah, that's so awesome. it's pretty cool. I mean, obviously, you know, Phase guys uh, have become good friends with you. Yeah. You know, you guys have become good friends. Uh, it's kind of led to you meeting a lot of other really cool people. That I mean, is all because of them. Yeah, which is pretty dope. I mean, it's yeah. you know, obviously, you know, I, I think it's cool. Like Summer Ray was. It was cool that Dude, you guys have become has snakes now. Yeah, yeah, she has a bunch of snakes, awesome. and you got. You said you're going to bring her out, so that yeah, yeah, yeah. She's going to come. Get, yeah, yeah, you got to sure. get her out here. Dude, she loves. Um, Dude, she's a big animal lover, man. Yeah, like, so that would be really cool. I mean, it's you know, but the thing is, is that um, as you found out, the downside of social success is that you get people that bash you for certain things, and and I think <laughs> it's I think it's it's a uh, it's a shame because, like, you're the perfect example <laughs> of. The fact that you were reach, you're reaching people that Summer Ray is a perfect example. Twenty yeah. something million followers. Yeah, Twenty four mm -hmm. million. Twenty four million. You kind of introduced her into buying snakes. Yeah, yeah. Uh, she's now buying snakes, and ultimately her following is going to see those and think, "Wow, if Summer likes them, mm. maybe I should like them." And it's interesting why sometimes some people, not all the, the reptile community, but a lot of the reptile community doesn't see that. You know, it, it's so true. So I was just talking to someone about this that, you know, um, you know, so I did a couple of videos that went viral. Actually, I did it with Noah. We took the mm. snake out to, you know, um, oh, yeah. Easy and Natalie, you know, then mm. mm, yeah. the most viral video I have ever done on any right. collab. And yep. again, I didn't promote it on my channel whatsoever. Right. It was just oh. their channel. I think yeah. right now in, uh, in in Facebook, it's like almost 10 million views wow. on it since yeah. we did it again. Yeah. So it was like six months ago. Yeah. And from that, um, just from that collab alone, I couldn't tell you how much positive, you know, yeah. people we've reached out to on that. Sure. Mm -hmm. And that's what these people don't understand. Like when they see these collabs that I've done, like these what's in the box challenges yeah. with all these things, they give me so much, you know, crap about it. But yeah. in all reality, man, it's reaching out to other people that never even seen these animals. Yeah. Like yeah. for example, the whole Ozzy Osbourne thing, like yeah. we did the, what he wanted to do, the what's in the box challenge. It's crazy. I man. pulled out some <laughs> snakes that he never even seen. He's like, oh my gosh, he goes, they look like that now. And I'm like, yeah. So we started talking <laughs> and then, you know, his son, Jack, you know, his, yeah. uh, his mm. daughter, they had a, a bearded dragon they had leopard geckos and people that's what people don't understand you know like a lot of people love these reptiles but i 
from what I've known, honestly, I think it's like in like the the reptile hobbyist. Yeah, you're just so close minded, and I'm, I'm, I'm this is just honestly my thoughts sure. that they keep this uh this industry from being where it should be at because they're yeah. so quick to bash someone for doing this yeah. like i mean you've been through it now oh well, yeah going you know i think it. i think when we were co- and we're, we're probably going to do a lot more collabs as this year goes on mm-hmm. last year we didn't do much collabing because we we're just so busy with things this year we have plans yeah. of doing a lot more collabing that that was the thing that i took always the most abuse from was collabing for it was crazy yeah. you know i mean obviously we did a lot with david dobrik and and um david is responsible for so I still to this day probably half the time I get recognized out on the street it's because of David Dobrik yeah. you know people be like oh my god that you're the guy from David Dobrik's vlog and and but people you know mm-hmm. uh, sometimes have a hard time realizing the benefits from it but let's back up for a second because fucking Ozzy Osbourne tell me this story yeah. tell me how this I mean you walk it's his house Dude. you send me a picture on his like stairway with like yeah. a million freaking <clears throat> gold albums or some shit yeah. I'm like what in the world so, is this real life Dude, yeah it was amazing so it's funny because I get a call on Saturday and last month I was like hey man I want to do what's in the box channels I'm like oh I was like I don't know I'm a little busy I didn't really you know been just focusing more like the business side of like for the the reptiles right mm-hmm. now and it's like, oh, it's for Ozzy Osbourne. <laughs> yep, <laughs> we'll, <be there. laughs> so we'll start getting all the animals right. And again, it's from the FaZe guys. I mean, if it was, yeah. I'll tell you right now, if it wasn't for the yeah. FaZe guys, and you remember how I linked up with FaZe? Sure I did, yeah. I you What's in the me. Box Challenge. It yeah. was actually You're Save like, Apex, yeah. It's, yeah. Uh, he wanted to do a What's in the Box with us. Mm-hmm. I just couldn't get out there. And, and then he was like, oh, that's a bummer. You know, this sucks. And I was like, Hang on a second. Let yeah. me call my buddy. Called yeah. you up, said, can you go do this thing? But, you know, listen, although may, I may have opened that door, you kicked it in. Right, yeah. you know, and that so you you really deserve the credit for that, right? Oh yeah, and since then, you know, I've you know, kind of like in Hollywood now, I'm known as like the snake guy. Like I'll yeah. run into some random people, like, oh man, you're that snake mm-hmm. guy. But I think every reptile person is their own snake guy sure. in their city. Sure. But um, again, so I go to the Ozzy Osbourne's house and I get there early to prep, you know, get the animals ready yeah. and stuff <laughs> like that. And are you allowed to curse in here? You can curse okay. all you want. So I really want to tell you is because I saw the funniest thing. So when Ozzy gets there. Let me first, I'll tell you, like, Ozzy, Sharon, Jack, all they, they are so nice. Really? I mean, dude, they're so loving, so welcoming. Mm. I mean, it's it's crazy. So yeah. he gets there, and he's like, you know, excited to do the what's in the box. He's like, so am I going to get bit? And he's all like, you know, he's like, because I'll pike that fucker back. <laughs> that's <what he> <laughs> I mean, that's Ozzy Osbourne. Like, how could you not, like, respect that, you yeah, know? Yeah, that's crazy, So the crazy right? thing is, doing his doing the what's in the, what's in the box with uh, Ozzy, he just didn't care. He's not scared. So yeah. he's just going in there grabbing everything. They're like trying oh, to nip, shit. grabbing just, left yeah. and right, left and right. <laughs> yeah, like you want everything. people that are a little afraid. Yeah. Oh, he yeah. wasn't afraid. Jack was like, all right, you know, because, but again, you have Ozzy over there egging him on, like, oh, watch out. Because he was so yeah. like into it. Yeah. Yeah. And the same thing, even when Sharon went on there, he's doing it too. And she she's just, did it too. Yeah. But she was like kind of scared. But he's, Ozzy's just like, you know, he was yeah. so good at it, man. And then <laughs> after everyone yeah. left, I stayed there and, you know, yeah. I was showing them pictures, you know, and, you know, it's funny because uh, when he had the, um, when he was with Black Sabbath and stuff, like the yeah. snakes that they had, they were Black Eastern Indigos that he had on oh, his, you know, shit. on his shirts yeah, and crazy. stuff. And I was showing them that's my favorite snake yeah, in my collection. Yeah. And, you know, we stayed there for about like 45 minutes just talking reptiles, wow. you know, and such great so. people, man. Yeah. No, that, cool. I love that type of stuff because, um, I mean, these guys are, I mean, that's Ozzy and, and Sharon obviously is now. And even Jack, they're, by the way, I'm big fans yeah, of yeah. Jack as well. You know, his, his, uh, they're living his legends, man. Yeah. I mean, these show. are like legitimately, I mean, they're royalty. I mean, yeah. they're, 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 you know, they're known worldwide. Yeah. I mean, Ozzy couldn't go anywhere without right. people mobbing him. Yeah. And, and for, to know that he's a down to earth, awesome guy. That's cool, man. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? That, can you imagine what this guy has seen in his life? A lot. Dude, a I mean, just, lot. I mean, he probably doesn't remember most of it. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah. But, um, a lot of people wouldn't be able to survive yeah. the court of the stuff that he's Gosh, done. Well, man. I think him Did... and his family, too, yeah. because what? just like you know, and Jade, the stuff that you guys just <laughs> see yeah. from the perimeter, just, like, yeah. That's a just lot. like that uh, movie on Netflix about that band. I always oh, forget the Oh, yeah, Motley Crue. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my yeah. It's called The Dirt. Yeah, it's yeah, called yeah. The Dirt. dirt. Yeah. Where, yeah. where he's at the public pool and he pisses on the ground. Oh, yeah, he was in that. And Ozzy, yeah. He, like, snorts his piss and ants and yeah. stuff like yeah. jesus dude what kind of guy you gotta well, be to do that i think that? he was on a lot of drugs probably then yeah yeah, yeah. he's uh <laughs> still that's awesome that but it's really cool man. But you know what's crazy though like i remember because i was a big fan of their show too you remember yeah like, the, the osborne the yeah. osborne yeah. yeah and cool. you know i used to always just watch and just being in their house and do you remember and I, when the season one uh, someone had made those puppets of sharon and oz yeah. yes stuff. yes they're still there, there. they have and all, all that like, awesome. i saw them i'm like and then you go and you see all the records that he's sold yeah that's ridiculous so is the spread crazy or what 
The what? Is this place nuts? Oh my gosh, it's it's insane, man. Really? Insane. It's not the same house from where the show is okay. at, mm. but it's close by. It's like, it's very similar. I mean, okay. but you go down to his like studio where we did it, it was yeah. just like, I mean, insane. I mean, wow. I mean I've mean, i done a lot of stuff with like a lot of artists, you know, influencers sure. like that, but to me, like Ozzy Osbourne is just one that just, it was kind of like, you know, chilling, oh, you know? Oh yeah, that's And then totally like showing thing. them some like, I'm like this on my phone, and then he like puts his arms around you. Now like Sharon's uh -huh. on one side, Ozzy's right there. I'm just like, <laughs> you know, like, right is there. This like real life? Yeah, I'm like, I made it. I made it. My yeah. sales on Bi Ball Python just went up like 50. Yeah, percent Like I don't I care. Chills, man. Yeah, yeah. You know? yeah, that's, yeah. that's that's just incredible. Now now you, do you stay in touch with Jack? You said you guys kind of yeah. So we, he got my information like that. I haven't reached out to him. I was kind of you know like because they were you know they were very very intrigued with just the yeah. snakes alone and stuff yeah. like that. But you know, dude, I got to get him on the podcast. Oh, I'm a huge Jack. I Ozzy's impossible, right? You know, but. Uh, Jack, maybe we can get him on because I'm, we, we're obviously into paranormal we love stuff. Yeah. He's stuff. got a, he's got the ghost. And they show. love reptiles too. Yeah, well, that's what mm -hmm. I'm saying. The bridge is Earth, there, yeah. but uh, um, it, it'd be a lot. To that would be, that yeah. would be really really. Oh cool my to gosh, do, man, man yeah. dude, it'd be so dope. I mean, it sucks that we're in Detroit a little bit because you know it's hard to get yeah. the people to travel. But the fact that he's uh, you know trying to do his own thing without his dad, obviously, you know, with the the, the paranormal show on travel, it would be kind of kind of cool. But you know, that yeah. it's just dope. No, yeah, man. they were all just I mean, it was it was definitely a cool experience. That and just bull riding alone has been one of the coolest <laughs> things, man. But let me catch up here real quick. We got the uh Mike again says uh, my best ticket was hundred and ten and a forty five. Jesus. Uh, <laughs> I bet that was you know, a lot. They had a bike go one eighty five, that's insane. What the hell? Uh, How see. can you even go that fast? <laughs> that would be scary on a bike. Yeah, yeah I, rem I remember uh, your brother Lee wanted to go 200, and he said he got to 190 that... something. Miguel, yeah. you, me, Damn. and some scotch this weekend. Oh, it looks like uh, you got someone coming here. Just turtle in the wax. Yeah, totally. yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Totally <laughs> the, wax. the wax squad. Yeah. Uh, Christine Kilroy, Kilroy uh, you're always great. She's always on here, so we appreciate it. Used to be a speed demon, got away way too many tickets. I get tickets constantly. It sucks. By the way, uh, we are doing that scotch for sure, hundred uh, percent. Um, but yeah, you know, so that's that's awesome. What do we got? Anything else, Jay? Are we caught up on that? Um, just always catching up on the super chat. So thank thank you guys for the super chat as always. Uh, mm -hmm. So what did uh, what was your highlight of Miguel's trip? When, when you tell them about the last day, no, <laughs> <not> the last <laughs> day. that yeah, was a true. low light, dude. That was a low light, yeah. Uh, I don't know the highlight, probably. I mean, it was all really cool. The face house is cool, you know. Yeah, uh, we got to beat up a the van. Uh, Did you? Oh, that's right. You guys smashed the and van. Then we went at to the a random house. party that was led to the other at uh, the other party, too. That was pretty cool. I yeah, I remember that. I remember that. <laughs> yeah, yeah I, I saw pictures uh, of it, but I, actually, I'm sure you didn't remember. Anyways. What, <laughs> uh, but so, have you been to the new Phase House? And for yes. the people that don't know what Phase is, Phase is like the largest like e-game. Uh, well, it, it, it is it the largest or what? Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, they're, they're, it's yeah. Phase. Yeah. What one. is it? F-A-Z-E? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. yeah. So yeah. just yeah. Google yeah. that. And if Did you, you see don't they made it on know. Forbes? <laughs> And Did their they, company yeah. got valued at like yeah. at three hundred and seventy one thousand three hundred million, 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 million dollars. And they're yeah. saying by the end of this year it should be a billion, billion dollar dollar company. Yeah. Which doesn't surprise me. You know, I mean obviously banks were super, super smart. Um Dude, all those you know, guys in there, man. I mean yeah, now that I mean I i I probably see them every week, right? Mm-hmm. And the stuff, man, their grind is on a next level, man. These guys work and work and they're just, you know, they're I mean, they're just killing it. Well, I think it. that's the thing, right? Is that People oftentimes look at, let's say, I think you you kind of figured that out early well, on. When people look at uh, social stars in particular, mm. whether it's the David Dobricks of the world or the Logan Pauls or yeah. or the Phase guys, you know, you think like, man, these guys are just hanging out, they're having a fucking blast, they're partying. Yeah. The truth is, it's the grind. It's the you know, I always say. Yeah. This is uh, when when I'm hanging out with the vlog squad, you yeah. know, with David and the guys. You know, it's like everybody in the room is just really on their phone. Right, they're just looking at their phone, they're posting, they're 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 Instagram, and they're set. Yeah. And then as soon as someone comes up with the camera, every one of them is acting. Yeah. Like, oh yeah, yeah. They're hey, on the spot. They're and then ready. as soon yeah. as the phone goes off, they all go back to their phones, right? Because uh, uh -huh. it's work, you know. I mean, don't yeah. don't get me wrong, they're having fun. Right. The phase guys are having fun, yeah. but it's it's the grind that people, and that's what success is, right? Yep. Not right. just social success. Say. Yeah. That's what, exactly what I was going to say. Anybody who is successful in life. Yeah works for it you know yeah. it's, it's funny like because i when i started hanging out with these kids you know and with these guys they were saying oh my gosh these kids are just rich spoiled kids blah, blah. Yeah. and i'm like mm -hmm. you think that but dude like 
Whenever um, you could get an audience of millions of people millions, to watch yeah. your stuff weekly, daily, you must be doing something and right. And retain dude, it. Exactly, because there's some right. networks yep. that can't right. even do that, like right. big networks. No, dude, yeah. it's crazy because literally I've been watching them since I was a kid <laughs> in <laughs> middle school. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. what they've evolved from is that, A, they were the best at the game that they played, okay, which takes a lot of hard work. Yeah. Uh, people kind of downplay video games a lot be like oh but they play video games they don't actually have like a talent oh you go do no, it then it's right a talent. no they I have something mentally and it. everything <laughs> it's, <laughs> they're bad dude they're amazing yeah, so they went quicker. from yeah. they went from that to being at the top of their game in the video game world and the phase clan still is but they, they the players yep. apex adapt all yeah. those guys yeah. i could go on forever they all evolved and now they're their personalities still, now yeah now their personalities that are still at the top of their game but they still evolved and yeah uh, it again and now it's goes like, to the hard work thing yeah. Yeah, yeah like they have the the guys that are like kind of like the influencers they have like the pro gamers i mean right. yeah there's just these little off brands of like the whole yeah there's company. a kids yeah. well that's the thing i mean so now smart. they're saying like yeah when you're in 24 25 you're already too old to game because yeah. your, your sense is just slowed down just that little <laughs> bit pro gaming now i'm not talking about gaming i'm talking game about over. game pro over game we're gonna go game again <laughs> maybe Thanks yeah. for you gotta get me. the senior yeah. level as well. next you're gonna tell me that i'm too old to bull ride no you're fine you're fine fine Bowling, is that what yeah. you no, bull riding. Bull bowling riding. Right. bowling as yeah. well. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, that's... You're probably right. I don't have that motion. I'm not going to yeah, lie. I would say, my elbow. I would say. <laughs> <laughs> but, but back to the house. Yes, yeah, I it's actually. Amazing. I saw you out, went out in the boat ride or something like that. Dude, it yeah. was so funny. Though, was that man. was that romantic? Because it was like you and. No, uh, it was scary as Was it Jarvis? It was, it was, no, Jarvis? it was actually Frazier and his Frazier, brother. Frazier, yeah, yeah. So oh, it was yeah. his brother. But it was crazy though. So I did something kind of messed up. And I didn't even know because. I went over to their house, right? <laughs> yeah, and a yeah. lot of people, I, you know, haven't really gone to the house yet. So I got there, yeah. you know, Rice shows up, you know, all the guys. Yeah. And we're just there hanging out. So he's like, oh, man, let's go fishing. So he went, at this time, I'm putting stories, you know, like, boom, boom, this and that. Oh, shit. The next day, they're like, hey, dude, take those stories down. Take those yeah. stories down. I'm like, wait, like, why? It's like, oh. they haven't done the announcement. They haven't oh, even they dropped haven't it even on their thing. Yeah, oh, so yeah. I'm oh. like, boom, boom, boom. It is tough. We, you know, we learned that the hard way oh, yeah. I, I learned that the hard way with a couple influencers where uh I, I i now don't post anything until they tell me i can you know yeah. right and because we had a, a video with uh, with logan paul actually it mm -hmm. was actually i was working with alex wasabi and he uh, this is when they all lived in at 1600 vine down in hollywood and um alex's apartment was right next to to logan's so yeah did you hear that Oh, do we got, you got, is that you, Noah? Maybe. Yeah, it was really Noah. <laughs> so anyways, we were, um, I was like, what is that? Yeah, what is that noise all of a sudden? So we, uh, we were at Alex's and Alex was like, let's go over to Logan's, you know, let's go see Logan. And so we walked out and I had my vlog camera and I just panned past Logan's number of his apartment. Yeah. You know, and I didn't even realize it, you know what <laughs> I mean? Nice. And so we put the video out and all of a sudden Alex's manager calls and it's yeah. like, uh, we're untagging you and everything. And at this time, this is back in the heyday of when of you weren't collapse. like that close with them. Or well, yeah, not only this is the first time I've ever worked with Alex. And uh, and back in the day, like now, you do a big, you know this. Yeah. I mean, every now and then you'll have something blow up, but most of the time when you do a collab, you're going to pick up a few thousand followers, maybe five thousand if you're lucky. This was back in the day when you'd pick up fifty, sixty thousand followers when you did a big collab. You so know, weird. And so we were, we like their video posted, and literally within minutes, I'm like a thousand, fifteen hundred, two thousand. I mean, it's just climbing my followers, right? And all of a sudden, I get the freaking call, dude. We're we're untagging you and everything, you know, because you know, blah. And I had to delete my video wow. in order for them to retag me in it. But I needed to, you know, I wanted to get yeah, that, yeah, that, definitely. That, that clout, you mm -hmm. know, so we did, we did, but it was, it was a you know, handful of other things like that, that taught me like, don't post a thing, you know what I mean? Until someone says, tell it's them. Cause it's like you said, yeah. I know that, uh, um, uh, Alex said that he was doing, it was like the day after that, as a matter of fact, he was doing like a house reveal. Yeah. And like you said, I had already seen a bunch of your stories. I was oh, like, dude, I was so embarrassed. <laughs> I was like, oh, I mean, well, you didn't know though. Well, you it's funny know. that none of the phase guys told me it was actually one of the, the, the talents, the managers, there. He's like, yeah, oh, cause he saw me, he's like, oh dude, he's like, you might want to take that. I mean, he was really cool about it, you know, but you know, speaking, they usually are. Yeah. Speaking of the collab things, man, you know, some of the best advice, I just want to bring this up that you have told me that just worked mm -hmm. out great. You notice I do a lot of collabs with these people now, but I never do it for my YouTube channel. No, I, my YouTube channel is strictly yeah, for my business, snakes. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. But my Instagram, Ooh, man, that thing's fire. Sometimes let me tell yeah. you, but, well, and that's the thing. But it's that's, a you know, I take world, that yeah. from, from, from you, yeah. you know, and it's honestly, what's probably the best thing 
that I've done. Yeah. Yeah. And it's good because, you know, you're obviously catering mm -hmm. on the reptile side to, to the niche, yeah. you know, uh, which is your customer base, which is, you know, ball python, specialty ball pythons, and, and you work with other cool stuff too. But um, obviously your YouTube, that's what they want, right? Yeah. And, and you're giving it to them well, whereas those are the people that probably would get perturbed if you had the other stuff on your YouTube channel. So you don't want to piss those off. And, and for us, you know, we obviously made the decision several, you know, three, four, five years ago to go away from that world as far as like not worrying about, you know, the, the, the people that want to invest in ball pythons yeah. if they care about what we put out. We put out content now that is a more mm -hmm. broad. So there's like this niche and then there's a broader niche, right? The broader niche is still animal people, reptile people, whatever the case may be. We just don't cater to the tight niche anymore, right? So, uh, yeah, that's that. Yeah. No, definitely. I mean, like I said, it, it's definitely on the ball python business side of it has helped me out, though. Because I remember when I started yeah. doing that other stuff, you're right, though, because I would get some, a lot of subscribers from it, but then the following would, really wouldn't be there, you know? And mm -hmm. I noticed yeah. it affected me more on the business side of things. Yeah. So I kind of just left my Instagram as the yeah, well, I always, side of yeah, it. and I always talk about hollow followers, right? You know, you, you know, back in the day when you mm -hmm. did pick up 40, 50,000 followers from Alex yeah. Wasabi, very few of those were actually people that cared about my content, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, but, but we still, uh, just this last weekend, we had someone came in that, um, gosh, it wasn't on Dobrik's vlog. It was an interesting thing. Oh, it was Sam and Colby, ironically enough. Someone came him? in and they said, yeah, I, I, this, this is the first time they came into the Reptarium mm -hmm. and they had seen me on Sam and Colby oh, yeah. like a year ago and or yeah. a year and a half ago. And uh, then they started watching and then ultimately ended yep. up here a year later, you know? So no it, it's interesting how sometimes those things can, can oh, yeah. you know, snake their way through. So we're, like that's, I said, we're going to get back to some collabs this year. Just like you said, and that's like one thing that's really surprising about me personally is like you said, hollow followers is, yeah. um, there's kind of like this rule in like the YouTube world where it's like, if you have 10% of your subscribers as your viewers, then you're good. Yeah. Like, then that's good. Like, oh, shit. Yeah. 10%, oh, I'm doing bad. Right? <laughs> <laughs> shit. Crunching the numbers. Ooh. Wow. And it's so <laughs> weird because like now my videos will like average like 30,000 plus views, 30,000 to 100. And I only have. 160, 170. Yeah. So it's like. I'm like, yeah, you're doing it's, really good. I, my channel's so weird because it's like yeah, I'm well, getting a lot of views, yeah, but not yeah. a lot of subscribers. Well, that's a lo yeah, loyalty. So strange. Yeah, loyalty, yeah. Yeah, it's it's good, though. I wish I, I had that problem. Yeah, yeah. I didn't <laughs> yeah. He's like lucky to get 20 yeah, views. Dude. Like, what the hell? Wait, <laughs> it's not that low. <laughs> dude, and that's what happens when you buy subscribers, dude, Miguel. I don't yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Did that's you buy them? I don't, I don't think you could. Wait, could you? You wouldn't want to because no. they'll you take your caught, channel yeah. down. Yeah, they'll take your channel down. Yeah, it's so was back in the day. A lot of people did that. You it know. doesn't even. Matter. You're never satisfied, dude. Yeah, that's it's, true. It sucks. You know, honestly. it was. I was getting uh, ripped on. Uh, speaking of summer rate, right? Mm -hmm. So, you know, I, I sold her some snakes. You know, she did these things on it. I picked up a lot of followers alone from it. And you know, this is what it, what trips me out about the reptile people, the reptile industry, is you know. If I post a picture of a snake and say it gets like 3,000, 4,000, you know, likes, mm -hmm. you know, it shows you how much people I've reached, right? Yeah. Yep. You put a picture up with um, Summer Ray and I get like yep. 13, 14,000 likes. Yeah. So it reaches out more people. Now I get hundreds of people that never even knew these snakes exist yeah. or just her buying right. it alone, you know, yeah. popularity. Mm. But then you get these people just after that, you know, that 12, you know, like 12,000 like post, I get demolished on it, right? Right. She's mm -hmm. not going to take care of animals. This one yeah. girl reached out oh. to me out of nowhere saying, you know, she's not going to take care of it. You know, I take uh, all these, um, adopt all these reptiles that people yeah. don't take care of. I'm like, well, like, you know what? Good for you. Yeah. But what these people understand is like these influencers like that, dude, they have so much assistance. I mean, yeah. Yeah, there's who are big you to animal know or lovers. To judge. Right. That yeah. animal but, could yeah. be living a better life the, the than any other animal. What yeah. I've learned though, and I mean, yeah. what I've learned, I mean, you guys honestly will have to agree with this, is it seems like the more, like the real reptile um, hobbyists are like some of the worst keepers. Like, yeah, yeah, I mean, well, well I guess yeah. it depends. Like, you're being generous saying the real reptile yeah. hobbyist. So, I'm gonna just say. <laughs> 
<laughs> the I, people I, who saw how I have, fed that out yeah. so you could go off and that don't sound like it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. Okay. The yes. people who just keep <laughs> this is the end reptiles of our business. Yes. <laughs> but think that, yeah. you know, yeah. this is the thing. Like, you know, self-proclaimed experts yeah. that also mm. think that it should be an elitist group that should keep or have the knowledge. You know, those are the exactly. people that freaking yeah. kill me. Guess yeah. what? Anybody who wants to keep a pet yeah. has the right to keep a pet. And who are you yeah, as long as they love it, to, yeah. Yeah, to de degrade well, them it's, it's a weird and thing. to say yeah. they shouldn't, you but know? The, but that's the problem, though. Like, the, it's like now, you know, there's a the bigger reach with the younger, you know, people getting into it now, yeah. you know? And the thing is, it's like... What I've noticed is like it, it's one negative comment leads to a hundred that leads to a thousand. Yeah. Oh, it's yeah. the mob it's mentality. The thing to do. Yeah. It's, right. the, mob, it's the mob mentality. Yeah. yeah. yeah well, think, that's the thing. I think people literally, you know, people hate me um, and they don't even know why. They just I can hate tell me. You. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. I'm I know totally exactly joking. why. Because you're, you're a terrible fact, person. I got my notes. Hold on. Yeah. Yeah. Like, uh, but yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's like it, like people just hear that I'm a bad guy <laughs> and they just believe it without even knowing it. Right. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. And I, I remember, think that's the mob mentality. It, it's true. Because I remember when I first got into this, everyone was like, oh my God, who's that guy just spending so much money? I yeah. remember they would call me a whale. Yeah. Right. And I didn't get yeah. the terms. I was like, that was, at that time, I was kind of like, what? Was it? You know, I was like, I was a whale. It's like, oh, it's not like, you know, like, <laughs> You're not a like, oh, <laughs> like, wait a second here. But they were saying, you know, <laughs> and like I, cut, so, I gotta cut some carbs yeah, out here. I was like, that, 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 that's why, you know, I got mixed up, but they were telling everybody, hey, stay away from Brian. Stay yeah. away from Brian. Stay that's away from Brian. because they didn't want you to spend exactly. money with him. Exactly. Yeah. The funniest thing. Everybody was thing, fighting for the money. And you won't remember this. It was the first time I saw you, my first Tenley show. And I was at the table and you were, I was sitting next to you and um, Lori, you were on the side right here. And I'm not going to say the person's name, but I don't know if you were paying attention, but um, the guy comes behind me. He's like, oh, man, he's trying to make a sale. He's like, you know, whatever you mm. spend here at the U.S. Ark auction, you know, we'll take it off and, you know, we'll put you on these group amount of snakes, which were like $30,000. And he, he puts his hands on my shoulder. And he goes, you know, do I really love what you're doing? You're doing really great. But if I was you, I'd stay away from, you know, Brian. And I remember <laughs> Lori is like right there. She just like goes, Gloop. And I don't know if she saw or paid attention to it, but then she just got up and left. And I was like, oh, man, it was the most yeah. awkward thing in the world. But what I'm saying to this, like when people yeah. told me they were telling me to stay away from you, yeah. I got that so much in the beginning. Yeah, sure. But I will say this right now. Sticking with you mm -hmm. was probably the best thing that's ever happened to me. And oh. honestly, <laughs> I wouldn't be where I'm at right now. Yeah. Like, and I told you once, if I ever passed you, that's probably when I'll stop talking to you. <laughs> yeah, like, I'm, like, I'm, <laughs> yeah. I'm hoping. I'm hoping that'll happen. Hey, respect. Yeah, no, because I'm just at least joking. you're saying it no, now. No, I'm just joking. No, I'm just joking. I respect that. No, <laughs> no, no. no it, it, listen, we'll you know, it's, it's, it's one of those <laughs> yeah, things exactly. that... Um, that's way too hard. <laughs> <laughs> we've talked about it a million times that, you know, those it, it sucks, you know, obviously that uh, obviously Tinley Park is coming. And I know a lot of yeah. people really were trying to get me to go to Tinley Park this weekend. Number one, we have our grand opening yeah. here. Uh, but more so, I, I just don't have the desire to go. Um, and a lot of people, like I said, have reached out to me in the last month, month and a half, said, please go to Tinley Park, please come to Tinley Park. But I guess it's just one of those things that it's a bummer that you know there were so many people that were yeah. gunning to try to tear well, me down for no reason. But where are those pain. people at now, though? Most, yeah, a lot of those, a lot yeah. of the, the people that were leading the charge are gone, are gone or you know or karma caught them in a bad yeah. way and uh but there's still a couple people out there that are you know truly horrible individuals that that karma <laughs> hasn't caught them yet i'm waiting though because it's coming shall not be named yeah i don't i don't talk about people i you know listen i've told people it's a lot of time i've got dirt on a few people that would crush them crush them you said you would never and, uh, share the stuff i said yeah. you bro. yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you should see that i'm going to post all of miguel's <laughs> messages yeah. to me check as soon out, as yeah. yeah check out brian's instagram no, but you, you know, the, the funniest thing was i remember when we were um when we went to tinley and i remember everyone's like oh man if, if brian gets her they're going to demolish them they're going to do this and this and yeah. that i remember um you had the van and we're walking down and helping you bring some yeah. stuff everyone's hi brian i hi, know brian. yeah that's hi, brian. Hey, yeah. Hi, brian. and i'm like that Wait, just, yeah. you were just saying stuff me about him. Yeah. Sick. Yeah. If you are going to talk shit yeah. and take a stand, then be a man and say it face to face. Yeah. Because yeah. I have way more respect for that than people that talk shit and then kiss ass in face. Exactly. Like, because yeah. that says what you are. You're but a yeah. lying piece of shit. And this, but it's you great know? though because I mean, you know, I mean, you are a big part of like what's happened with this whole reptile show. I'm not gonna lie, just from yeah. you bringing myself into it, and I see now the people that I'm reaching out alone just yeah. from what you've caused. I'm done. I mean. You being at these shows are so good for the, you know, the shows, Well, it's, man. It, that's what I always thought was interesting was that, like, why would you take the guy that w has one of the biggest followings and kick him out of the hobby? 
Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, why well, would you do that? You like, why what? would you this push thing, that no, guy out? You know what I mean? Kicked us out no, of we hobby. chose exactly. to we chose to leave because we you know it was it was we not worth yeah. the hassle anymore. And I knew what I was doing. And and this is the thing that's interesting, Miguel. I don't know if I've ever told you this, but you know those people that really led the charge uh, to you know, make me look like a bad guy and, and hurt my business. They, they wanted to destroy BHB, right? Yeah. That's what they wanted to do. The thing is, is that those people <laughs> are the reason why I am t here today, right? Because I probably wouldn't have the Reptarium. Right. I probably yeah. wouldn't have started daily vlogging. Right. I would probably start all those things if it wasn't for those people pushing me away. So really and what the they did the is it is. backfired on them because yeah. I'm more, we are more successful yeah. today than we've ever been BHB because of them. BHB as a whole is. You know, yeah. and it's a whole different thing and it's not competing with them, but it pushed us into something yeah. that something actually better. Something is bigger. better. Yeah. So it's you interesting know? because so. they're still wallowing in the yeah. same crap that they were in <laughs> and, and, yeah. and they, they helped me yeah. in a, and they thought they were hurting me and yeah. in actuality. It, it, was it was the best yeah. thing that could you know, have ever happened. It, it happened the mm -hmm. same thing yep. for me just recently. Like all these people that were trying to make these fake accounts of me saying all these things I was doing, blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. All the people that were doing that are not even in the oh, industry shoot. anymore. They're completely yeah. out. That was me. <laughs> well, it was you, right? No, so, but, yeah. you know, like, but what I've noticed, though, too, Hide your phone. <laughs> in, the, in the reptile world, if you know, say like the bigger, bigger people, if yeah. you're not a part of their clan or their group yeah. or whatever, you're just you're just not going to be a part of them ever, and they're always yeah. going to keep it down. But again, that's what I consider being so close-minded and keeping this industry yeah. from getting, yeah. dude. This industry, the way it's growing right now, it could be amazing. It could be honestly yeah. like bigger than anything. Yeah, it, it already is amazing, but it could be so much no, more. No, by yeah. a, yeah. I mean by far. I mean, but the thing yeah. is, there's just so much people that you know bash this place but again what bothers me the most is when people make fake accounts or this i'm like i always tell them like dude why don't you just tell me who you are and yeah. just say it to my face what you ever notice noah you probably noticed this with What's youtube this? is that you, do you ever notice that the worst what? comments that you have which i don't care about i seriously do not care about negative comments at all but have you ever noticed that they're always ones that just have the the like generic dot on them they yeah. don't have a never picture face. they don't have the a letter <laughs> just the letter of their yeah. name yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. That, it's it's never it's yeah. never an, actual person yeah. that is going to own up to it it's always that way yeah. you know i really don't get much and no, if i do i don't look and i don't get much either but i mean when i do i don't know uh weirdly enough i tell this all the time it's weird like if it, you know youtube is is shockingly good for us as far yeah. as comments go that being said jay and i were just talking about this the other day when you have videos go viral like oh, you yeah. had that albino uh rattlesnake eating video viral yeah i'm sure there's a gazillion the horrible ideas the more <laughs> viral it gets the worse the comments are i have yeah, to I have, make well, sense though. wait wait yeah the worst one i have is one defending you that one and it didn't even go viral, <laughs> it didn't even go viral but it's the worst comments yeah, and dislikes yeah. in any yeah, you yeah. know video that yeah. i have so yeah no, that, that, that happens that happens uh let me catch up real quick olivia Wait. uh go ahead okay. sorry Laura. no oh, i was just gonna say that jay's mom said that miguel looks like a movie star by the way oh just yeah so you know. where, where do i look at where's... you look like the guy from sicario where's... Where's... it's like yeah, yeah you do kind of <laughs> it's like every every mexican you know yeah. You look like every Mexican. I mean, guy. there is some truth around that area in the Sicario industry. No, I'm just joking. I'm just joking. Oh, big shout out. Thank you. Made my day. Uh, uh, Olivia, how's it going? Long time no see. Can't wait for the expansion open on Friday. Thank you, Olivia. Yeah, hopefully, I hopefully you're, you're coming. Thank you so much. Uh, Sharon again uh, deleted the message. Damn, but, uh, Jason deleted that shit. Jason, why did you delete that? Dang, I don't Jason. know what she deleted, but we I'm need sorry. To look into love Jason the, and kick him off. Yeah, sorry, Damn. Jason. Don't delete our super chats. Uh, love the podcast can't wait to come see you guys brian what's the best first snake a hog knows one of them i i think hog knows are really great first snakes to be honest with you, you get a good captive one that's doing really well uh jimmy uh from up north uh jimmy from up north is going to cool. said he's going to come i think next friday so yeah it'd be great awesome or, or next weekend yeah. so jimmy will be good to see you again tyler miguel talk about the magma gene we can talk Ooh, about that for magma sure gene, yeah. i'd like to hear about that we'll talk about that in a second pat uh from a business view uh do you feel like the coronavirus will affect your business I, I think, listen, uh, let me get back to that in a second. Uh, okay. Can you go up one second? I, I don't know who that's from, Jay. Uh, nope, 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 nope. The nope. one down. The other one down. Yep, down. Next. Yep, thank you. Uh, Jessica, I uh, love you guys. Thank you so much, Jessica. Appreciate you. So, uh, and then, of course, we have... Um, Perla Genesis Thompson. Hey everyone, Miguel, uh, that's the best beer. There you go. Uh, <laughs> Ultralight. Shout out from Seattle. Oh my gosh, Seattle. Be careful out there, guys. The, vi the virus is, is getting you Perla, out of there. Cheers. But cheers. cheers. Thank you so cheers much. I appreciate you. Uh, and they're good on so, cards. Uh, yes, I think 
uh, you know, we won't get into oh, it. Oh, big shout out to Wes, Westworld. I like him, man. Yeah, really oh, yeah. Cool. oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Wes, what's up, yeah, dude? Wes the homie. Yeah, he's good. He's good. Yeah, and shout out to Barrels, too. Yeah, KB. Not Carrie. Yeah, Wes, Not Carrie, uh, just, Wes just went through some. I uh, like Carrie. Some, uh, do you? I do. Talk to her and you'll see. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I love you, Carrie. <laughs> She too, was just texting too me. Too late. Now, guess me. what? I just got a message saying Dang kick it. your ass. No. <laughs> Damn. And you know she will, too. She, she will. Yeah. will. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, Sorry. I think I think uh, we won't get into it. But, yes, I think the corona could. Uh, um, I think well, so. It can affect could, every could business. Affect every business. And it's probably because of the, uh, this is what I've said. Yes. I think five years from now, don't get me wrong. It's horrible. Uh, and I think some people are going to die, which sucks. A lot of people, right? Well, you know, any and every. Yeah, I was gonna say, every, like people, people are just die. dying right now. Let's clean no, house, no, baby. A, no, but listen, you know, if it, <laughs> it, it, when it affects people's families, now I know where you get it from. <laughs> yes. when it affects from people and families, it's a bummer. But that being said, five years from now, I think we're going to look back on this, and the effects of Corona from a health standpoint are going to be nearly as bad as the hysteria that was caused from. You know, oh again, God. Italy shutting down. Yeah. You know, think Dude. about the people in Rome that make their business from tourism that Dude. now has no money. Think about Washington State that is shutting down. Think about who did you just say that that sports team said that they're the, the Warriors, the Warriors, which is NBA team based in California. Where are they? San Francisco. I'm pretty sure the Bay Area. Uh, uh yeah, the Bay Area. So yeah. yeah, so their home games are now not going to have any fans in the arena. Till further notice. And That's I'm crazy, pissed man. because I am going to a game next weekend. So not this upcoming weekend yeah, to LeBron. see LeBron freaking James. And I'm going to be so pissed if they say no fans in Detroit. Because guess what? I don't know if I'm ever going to be able to see LeBron play again. And well, if uh, I don't get to see him this time, let's just then hope I'm a the freaking, hysteria stays away from I'm gonna be Michigan. Pissed. We're still pretty low on the. Well, we just had a couple. Right co yeah, we just had a couple. I'm cases still going, today, but uh, I don't but care. No, I don't care I'll either. Break but, in. I, I was just gonna I'll say I'll come with you and I'll break the doors. But in my for point you. is, is that you know, look at that. So <laughs> the Golden you. State Warriors, the guy that's selling beer there, lost a lot of money. Oh the guy my. that you know, the people well, that clean the stands, the people that much money they make. Yeah, restroom. Yeah, yeah, just pee on the floor. Just use so, one of no, yeah, you can go right. You go right the, the stairs. stairs. <laughs> All right, Miguel's. Uh, we'll we'll talk about the Magnum Gene when uh, when Miguel comes oh, back. Shit. You can go right this way. You're fine. <laughs> we don't keep you down here. We're uh, we're, we're uh, the podcast setup down here is a little bit janky. We're actually doing a brand new podcast room, maybe as yes. early as next week. Uh, yeah, probably not next week, but we've got plans next week. Um, so Stuart from Universal Rock. No, yeah, he's literally coming. We're literally he's coming, doing it. and and we're doing a man cave. Did he down get cheap here. flights? Yeah, yeah, they're yeah, like yeah, twenty bucks. Yeah, every flight's cheap <laughs> I know, now. right? Actually, speaking of that, yeah, Jade called when we were mm -hmm. on our way back yeah. today, and uh, she's of my mindset. Like, let's go book some hella vacations right now. No, that's exactly flights what are me and cheap as hell, and Jay I'm like, and I'm like, guess what? That's what I say. Dad's like, not me, but I'm like, heck yeah! So, like, let's go. So, are they still somewhere. cheap if we book out in advance right now? It just yeah, depends. well, it's, it's not as I looked at it's a bunch as cheap of different as things I think because we should be. Yeah, because I was looking at yeah. uh, Italy because we're supposed to go to Italy. Ironically enough, Italy shut down. We're supposed to go to Italy in October. October. But right um, now they're not even. But taking the flights, bookings. yeah, the flights are not very good. You know, <laughs> I mean, the it's ones you can literally shut down. Well, yeah, you can't book today, obviously, but by October it's going to be back up. But we'll but the flights uh -huh. were not very good. But you know what's happening right. is a lot of airlines are canceling flights, so there's not like. A bunch of, I mean, there are empty planes, but yeah. if they flew four flights to Rome well, a day, now they're only flying, flying one flight. You want to talk you know? about funny, weird things? Go ahead. So I heard, so in the um, EU, the airlines have to actually make the flights because they have to have planes that land in the different airports to keep their spots. Oh, and they okay. finally just so today just... like lifted it. They were flying empty planes yeah. just to so they could keep their spots at right. the airport because of this. Mm. And because yeah, of sense. like Italy shutting down and all these other things, yeah. they lifted that for the airlines. But I thought that's just crazy as hell, like that they had that mandate on these airlines that they had to make so many flights to keep well, their spots, yeah. their parking spots, no, I guess, a, at the airports. Yeah. I mean, it's it's a crazy <laughs> thing. Uh, by the way, uh, Sherry said, uh, is Jade coming down? 
sometimes. Bring, uh, Miguel, bring the fam. Yeah. Are uh, you yeah. ever going to bring your family to see the reptarium? I literally yeah. was thinking this today. No. Because no. that Why? means I can't go out. I won't be able to hang. Yeah. You know yeah. what? Because that's what I thought. This is bullshit. <laughs> no. It, that you come and do your own thing and the wife and kids I, okay, don't I will get say to. No, I, I'm going to. I'm calling but, bullshit. No, 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 no. I'm going to. You You're know welcome, what? Tina, Teresa. honestly. Tina. <laughs> no, Tina, honestly, like she does so much over there. If, if, for example, if both of us leave, yeah, dude, that whole place are. is just gonna go down. Like, yeah, you know, you know, it's, you got your brother, right? That's right. Big shout out to my brother too. But yeah, Tina, he, Tina does a lot of like the yeah. other kind of shipments and stuff like that that Jesse doesn't oh, do. I know. But so, guess yeah. what? That's how I am. We talk but about the same way. Still, it's it's hard for us to, to get take, away. But I mean, yeah. But then you guys won't get the real me. Have you guys seen me around Tina? No. Yeah. Dude, I, have, it's, I have. It's like maybe I dude, like maybe I like the you. other like you. This. Maybe I like the other you. Let me no. tell you. <laughs> Wait, maybe I do. You he is whipped. He is whipped. <laughs> she has him by the throat and I, by the balls. Yeah. Literally at the same at time. He can't do anything. So is that how you are when I'm not around? Oh, when you're not around, I'm a fucking maniac. Let me tell you. I'm like drinking. Uh, I'm drinking, no. smoking I'm weed. Right, it's the same person, dude. I've never yeah. seen this. <laughs> I've never seen this before. I'm not even joking. <laughs> Tina has a fucking a uh, whistle. She'll go. She does. And then, <laughs> and then, I'm not gonna lie. Miguel, no. he doesn't he even. Just, like, no, he just, he just prances. He doesn't over walk there. normal. He goes on all I fours gallop. and he I fucking gallop. and he you know runs what? over I, her. I, I am it's taking, crazy. I am taking a trip because I need to talk to Tina. No. Oh, yeah. 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 Talk yeah. these guys away Hell from each other. Yeah, man. I do. No, I'm yeah. getting a fucking whistle. Listen, if these, if, if, <laughs> right. if Turtle and, and, and Lori get together, we're in trouble. <laughs> Yeah. We're oh, yeah. in trouble. Oh, yeah. no. we're, we're, our lives will never be the no, same. But in all honesty, I do want to take oh, yeah. to a lot of these things. But I you know, like I said, Tina totally holds everything down. Yeah. Like if it, it just if this oh, will happen, yeah. if she comes with me when I get back, He's I get nightmare. backed up with work, yeah. and now I'm just like then I go I stress out yeah. and I yeah, go crazy. Yeah, sometimes that, Howard, that's, that's life, and that's yeah. just what happens. Sometimes it's harder to leave. I see what you're doing, I see what you're doing. I'm glad you're here, but you're not welcome back without her next time. Oh man, damn! I hope she's watching. Man, that's why. That's rough. She is. Yeah, she's got turtle. Guess who's coming on the next trip? Turtle. Turtle. Jesus, turtle. So abort. She probably wants to come. Oh my god. So there we go. No, she probably does but she just yeah. can't <laughs> she just can't no, she just can't no she can't she can't she can't we um can. <laughs> just like we uh let's see uh let's let's touch real quick about the magma gene just because i mean what do you think i mean obviously know you know uh it's it's uh, it's a red stripe yeah it's a red, red it's stripe red stripe with clown yeah, yeah. So, okay. so that's the magma project um, yeah so that's the magma stripe project clown. i mean it's okay. really cool i mean the pompeii stuff is amazing um yeah, you know, all that stuff is, is 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 pretty dope. But uh, obviously, you have a lot of. Is this up right now, Jay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, oh, so cool. obviously, you have a lot of really cool ball pythons. Obviously, there's summer ray, by the way, um, right there that summer. Let's not okay. get off topic. Magma. Magma. Do you have a picture? Oh, and of then one you on got. Here? Oh yeah, you met Bradley Martin yeah, too, which Steve is will Steve, do it Steve will do it yeah. too. We t it was just it's Facetime him before we left. So oh my a God. lot of really Scaleless. cool stuff. You don't burn those. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, right. so obviously Miguel is, uh, I freeze his, them. Is, yeah, is, them. I don't for it. Is, is that it? Is Instagram? No, there's no magmas in there. Uh, um, keep going, keep going. You're almost there. You're almost there. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Lower, right. lower, lower. See, this is when, uh, when Brian maybe uh, become an influencer. Yeah. Okay. Look go at to the left. People. Go to the left. All the way to the left. Right there. Yeah. yeah there you go. Oh yeah, that's pretty. What is that? That's black pastel red stripe clown. Yeah, yeah. black yeah. pastel red stripe All clown. Right. Well, but the Pompeii stuff is probably like really where that whole thing wow. goes. So, so the magma starts, yeah. and then the Pompeii is where it it you know. really pops. You know, it's it's so crazy. Like you know, it's like a normal. So no, yeah. no. It's a remember, pastel, it's a pastel clown over there. Damn, okay. remember <laughs> your mother for sure, dude. Jesus, how do you how do you do this, dude? A lot Just, of drugs, man. A lot of drugs. It's even worse. Really? <laughs> oh, Jeez. yeah. You know what's so funny? So, Aubrey, oh, yeah. Jay too, yeah. my get daughter Jay together and I is, get just, is just like me, right? We have, like, the same silly personality. When Tina's there, she's just like, I cannot deal with you, too, you know? But it's kind of, you know. <laughs> well, like, li literally, when Jade, Noah, and Laura are together, I, I am, like, attacked <laughs> just, yeah. just fetal position. listen yeah. listen i've been i like there was how old you were oh like God. 10 honey mustard honey right mata. yeah honey mata. i get this for i get the, go ahead no it was the best dude wait i haven't so, heard this yeah nobody has yeah. this is brand new for the world yeah so, thank you but not you know, our family not our family mcdonald's right yeah. it's like a staple of america yeah yeah and all that yeah so 
Yeah. I was a little kid, and then my sister's eight years older, so we're both relatively young. Yeah. We're hungry. Let's go to McDonald's. Let's get a little meal going. <laughs> and we're in the, the drive-thru. Yeah, it, we're at the drive-thru, and at the time, McDonald's had the snack wraps. Yeah, right? snack yeah. wraps. They had yeah. all oh, the those different, were so yes. bomb. Yeah, had, yeah, yeah. They had honey mustard. They had, yep. like, barbecue. barbecue. Yep. And they yep. had yep. a couple ranch. different ranch. Ranch, ranch. Yeah, ranch. Yeah. Yep. Yep. And we're going, and it's dad's turn. We all order. It's his turn. <laughs> and he goes, and also, I will take one honey mata snack wrap. <laughs> Is that what you said? Yes, yes. So I got that, stuck the whole time. Oh, my God. Still, well. ten, 12 years later, they we're still in, mess with me. We're in the drive-thru. We oh all my start God. dying laughing. laughing. And you can't stop saying, honey mata, <laughs> honey mata. <laughs> Could you not say honey mustard? Yeah, I just, I just like, tripped up on the word. You know? oh, yeah. just, honey let me say honey never. mustard. <laughs> Honey mustard. Oh, yeah. No, you got it. No. You got it. Yeah. But he tried hard no. there. For years, <laughs> he though. Was, he was like, concentrated. He's like, it still comes up. Mustard. He does. He has to think when he says it. Honey, Honey mustard. mustard. Yeah, I'll never make that mistake. Literally to the point, they gang up on me so bad that like it's every bad. Thanksgiving, oh, you know, yeah. oh, they, they, listen, I, fuck, I hate there? pumpkin pie. I don't oh, like pumpkin yeah, pie. Same here, same I hate here. pumpkin pie. Who likes but, it? But the, well, these guys say he I like it. it. Yeah. He ate it for years. Yeah, I never ate it, ever. But my whole family, literally, they'll every person will be like, does Brian like a pumpkin pie? Oh, yeah, every year he eats it. I'm like, no, I don't. I it's, don't like it. It's not just And they'll, they'll literally the gang up on me. Remembers but why? Why, why would okay. I lie? Why no, would I lie? This is my 100% true story. <laughs> Maybe or, they didn't oh, like no, it no, at no. one time. Not true story. My my 100% uh, thought process, okay? This is the Mandela effect. Old Brian that we have and we all know likes pumpkin pie. You're a new Brian you from are. a different fucking universe, you okay? <laughs> I'm I not joking. I think, yeah. You know what? No, Holy this is shit. real. That's I never probably thought why I fall about down. that. Oh my god, no! Yeah, Mandela I effect. Think about what's what's changed. He Pumpkin has no pie. Sense, no sense of balance. No balance. He no balance. All the time. Doesn't wear cargo shorts anymore. Oh my god! Yep. Dude, you no, used to rock wear, those no all the time. I know. Remember how cold okay. he was, oh, and so he hasn't been wearing a cold. No coat anymore. Oh, I want to talk about something. We actually, I don't even want to. New Brian. You are not. Okay, you guys have talked enough. Dude, I have to say something. What you guys are talking about? I go back and remember scared. all the older videos and stuff like that because you brought up the cargo yeah. shorts. Oh yeah, cargo. You know when people make the um, <laughs> the the dad starter pack? Oh, that's yeah. dude, oh my god, Brian? the shoes. <laughs> yes, the that's shoes. What I was getting that. The dude. white Nike shoes. No, I think they were New, new Balance. balance. Yeah, new, new Balance. balance. Mm. I, dude, I God. swear, I'm like, Brian looked older 20, 15 he years ago than yeah. he does now. 100%. But, which reminds me of, dude, what was the story with the shoes thing? Remember, you told me this. Oh, oh. it was playlist. Yes, that's what it was. Oh, yeah. So yeah. let me tell you this the story was a cool, real quick. I like so, the story. So, yeah, so like Noah, uh, we went to Playlist Live, uh, which is a big YouTube convention Just in Orlando. 2016. Yeah, 2016, yeah. whatever it is. And so uh, I really, it was interesting. Like, I was a YouTuber, but I was, I, it was pre-vlogging. I hadn't yeah. even started vlogging yet. And uh, so I was snake doing snake bites, bites for days, ten yeah. years, and and I was a YouTuber, but not it wasn't like my profession. It wasn't something I took real serious. But Noah was getting older, and and he was really inspiring me to take it more seriously. Mm. So we went down to playlists to go hang out with, you know, get to know some of these YouTubers. And this is back in the day when it's a bummer now. Playlists and VidCon, none of the big guys show up. Yeah, you know? yeah. So literally. Sad. Uh, we're meeting all these big names. Now, playlist I mean, was like the VidCon of it, now. Th yeah, I mean, it, it's about it the same. In Orlando, it's, yeah, it's about but, to say, yeah, yep. it's, it's almost the same. VidCon and playlist were almost playlist the same. Playlist was more hype. Yeah, yeah, I think playlist was more hype then. So, anyway, so Jesse Wellens <laughs> from Prank vs. Prank, probably the story. probably one of the biggest <laughs> YouTubers on the planet um, at the time. First off. I guess we met him the day before. Yeah. I don't remember because I don't know who Jesse Wellens is. The dude has like 10 million subs, this whatever is, case is. No yeah, we were at the party. Yeah. There were, every night there's a party and there, we were at the party and I was fans of them. So I meet, I see both of them walking, <laughs> Jesse and his girlfriend at the time. And I'm like, oh shit. I'm like, dad, let's go get a picture. I get a picture. We say, what's up? Exchange some words, move on. Yeah, we move on. And so the next day we were, we're in the green room back or right outside the green room backstage. And, um, and, and I will tell, I, this is amazing that Jesse remembered me because I go up to him and we talk and I go, hey, it's really good to meet me, meet you. And he goes, oh yeah, I met you yesterday. <laughs> and so here's one of the biggest YouTubers on the planet. I don't fucking remember even yeah. meeting him yesterday. He, he pulled a Lori out. Yeah, and, and, but it was crazy that he met all these people and he yeah. like remembers me. He's you like, he's like, yeah, I remember. But no, listen, but That's so, so he then he, so he, no, 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 he didn't. No, okay. because no, listen, 
So he looks down at Noah's shoes and he's like, yeah. dude, dope shoes, man. And then he looks at me and he's like, oh my God. he just looks down and he goes, oh. He just goes, yeah. oh. Just, oh, because I got these ratty freaking like, you know, New Balance shoes. New Balance, yes, the, the new, white the, New Balance. The, the dead starter pack dude, shoes. Oh, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. And, and they, were, what they weren't fresh, every, though. Every, they were fresh. They were every year, he got one pair every year. Every year. Like, yeah. for this, Christmas or birthday, oh he my got a gosh, fresh dude. pair. Like, that's what it was for years. And yeah. it was so cool, too, because the, the reason why he complimented my shoes. He had the white, triple white NMDs, actually, right? Because So these shoes came out at the time. They're called NMD R1s, right? Yeah. Holy shit. And they <laughs> were shit. so rare. I bought a few pairs and stuff, sold some. But so I had them, and there was only one guy at the entire playlist that Harley, had right? another yeah, one. Yeah, I was Harley, say. Harley, Harley yeah. playlist. Yeah. yeah. So I was stunting with these fucking flavor savers. I was just like, <laughs> flavor saver. Boy, like, oh my God, I was crispy, right? Yeah. And I'm just walking around feeling so good. And then he compliments my shoes. I'm like, fuck Heck yeah. yeah. Like, nobody, oh, I'm like, game nobody over. else should be game over. He's right. And then he roast you. I was like, yeah. I was, was laughing. But that's what, that's what made me get into sneakers, yes. really. You know, he I mean, came I, home I like was and like, game over. Well, when All he was on ever since is go, go and all these other things. Yeah, oh, yeah. buying that, shoes yeah. like crazy. When I first hung out with, like, started hanging out with them, I'm like, dude, you have, like, cool shoes. And then he told me this whole story. And I was like, oh, wow. Like, it's like so traumatic that I yeah. and like I'm like listen to this never gonna be caught can I tell a quick story real quick no okay go ahead go ahead this is about goat go ahead this is go. about goat this is why and this is quick too so I've been using goat for years right mm -hmm. fuck goat okay whoa, fuck goat whoa, this okay. is getting good so whoa. so Damn. I got what happened so on, <laughs> yeah I want to go there's these uh people selling oh, I remember you told me this uh, yeah not Let that the whole story but Shh. Okay, go ahead. go ahead. I know, right? So <laughs> so people sell shoes on Go. Anybody. You could be selling me a shoe we didn't know. So there was this great deal. I've been looking at this shoe for years, probably seven <gasps> oh, years, no. right? So uh, the price of the shoe is $600. So I'm like, okay, I'm not going to buy it, right? But I have it bookmarked. So if a good deal pops up, I'll get a notification. Yeah. Notification pops up, $150. I'm like, fuck, this is a $600 shoe. So I click it. I buy it immediately. I'm like, yes, I just made like wait, six hundred dollars is six hundred dollars is what? Oh, you're balling! <laughs> no, no, six hundred dollars. What is, it normally is six hundred dollars okay. is what it's priced at, but somebody posted it for a hundred and fifty. Oh, steal! So I got the steal. I made like five hundred bucks off it. I'm like, yes, let's go, let's go. A full week goes by. It says. Order has been canceled <gasps> by seller. Oh, no. Yeah. So I, I remember you told me you were so excited. You of got Of course that. I was so excited. And it's bullshit that it went by a week because it should be shipped by yeah. a week. So uh, they canceled it. I, I replied to them. I'm like, hey, let's sort this out because this is unfair to me. I don't right. care. I've waited a week. Technically, I should have the shoes in my hands already. Because and he just canceled it. Because they take the money out automatically. Oh, yeah. My money oh, was gone. That's all that. Guess no. what? Wait, well, you didn't get back. your money back? Yeah, you oh, I got money. my money back. Yeah, but, but still, still, that's bullshit that they can do that. Yep. It could have been so, worse. So I email yeah. them, blah, blah, blah. Been, all they say is, nope, there's nothing we can do for you. I say, fuck you. I'm going to StockX. Shout out StockX. <laughs> all right. But go, I got banned from the app. Fuck they, go. They StockX. There you go. Dude, <laughs> so dumb. So we yeah. could so curse them here, huh? Yeah, obviously. Yeah, you can. Uh, fuck. But we're <laughs> I've been wanting to do that so bad. <laughs> is that the first time you've yes. ever said that? <laughs> Shit. No, I'm just sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sorry. I'm just joking. Oops, Carol. I'm just sorry. No, it's uh, but we went to this, <laughs> we went to the school yesterday. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, do you want to tell Chandler's the whole, are you going to tell the whole story? Wait, wait, what happened? Or should I not? <laughs> well, I mean, I don't to know. start with the pants that you're still wearing. Uh, yeah, you're still I'm, wearing. Because I'm working. <laughs> if I'm working, I know I'm going to get oh dirty. So I've got some dirty <laughs> pants on because I've been working. Those are you know? cool shoes. Those are some yeah, cool some, shoes. Right, exactly. Yeah. So we go into this Chandler <laughs> Academy. Balance, Chandler right. Academy in Detroit. We go in, uh, you know, it's like an urban school and stuff like that. And uh, it was funny because because the kids, you know, probably never really got exposed to reptiles before, right? You know, and and uh, so they were a little bit afraid, you know, at first, but they, they turned out to be great. It, like so many, you know, kids, yeah. like you go in and they're kind of tentative and there's stuff like that. By the end, they're all holding shit, you know, it's yeah. really cool. But, um, but the one guy says that, he's like, man, he's coming in here with that drip. <laughs> you know, with my shoes, he's like that drip. He's that like, those are awesome. he's like, those right. are thousand dollar shoes right there. And those it, right there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, they're all right. Yeah. Those are so, awesome. They're awesome. I like so them. I am going to rain in your parade because I'm going back in time. 
Uh-oh. So we're driving to the zoo to you presentation. Yeah. I look down because in the morning I'm in the bathroom yeah. and I'm getting dressed and I look down at his pants and I was like, Oh no, I got to tell him he needs to get some fresh pants on because we've got this presentation to do. Yeah. I didn't, I didn't think about it. We're driving. I looked down. I'm like, Oh, are you kidding me? Yeah. You got those dirty, nasty pants on. When we're again. doing a presentation. It's, it's yeah. Just, you didn't see that. They're just dirty. They look cool. They're they just, look dirty. No, I can't see it. No, just they dirty. don't. What's wrong with but them? literally they're just we're ta- dirty. Yeah. You know, I've been, I've been working. I got all the, the dust thing. on me from, you know, it's like, I'm not going to put thing. on a clean pair of pants. You didn't like drop any honey mustard on there. They're probably in. But this is the funny thing. Cause that's what I tell him. He was like, I'm sorry. You know, this and that. I was yeah. like, whatever. I said, you just need to like up the personality so they don't like oh, notice the like pants. Your, right. Yeah. But I said, and then he told me the shoe thing. I said, I guess it all worked out because all they were looking at yeah. is your shoes. It's my drip. And, oh, really exactly. my drip. Yeah. and they just thought it was probably a cool like grunge, yeah. whatever pants. So is that what drip not, means? <laughs> like your Dude, but, drip yeah. is like style. If you got good style, yeah. you got drip. Well, you got the drip. He's got, yeah. yeah the, the <laughs> but camo you got the drip back in the day. The was not the drip you <laughs> wanted. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no, no. Different kind of drip. Yeah. You're I'm just a, telling your age. Yeah. This is what's going on. I've had the drip here. before. Let me yeah. tell you, you don't want the drip. <laughs> <laughs> just joking. Just joking. <laughs> you need some antibiotics for the drip. Penicillin used to cure the drip real quick. Oh, no, I'm moving a little bit further away. Oh, my God. How'd that even happen? Quarantine. Yeah. Yeah. You've, so, ev- he's a, you've evolved from O to drip. Yeah, <laughs> right. drip. yeah drip. exactly. Oh, yeah. Those oh. You know, I'm like, I'm, I am like, I'm drip. like, you know, fine wine, you know, you age and, you know, go, go the right yeah. way, right? Yeah, yeah. Like That's a, what I always tell like Tina. A, I'm like, like I'm like a fine, fine wine. wine. Yeah, right. Yeah. Lori actually showed me a picture of <laughs> yeah. us. Uh, oh, Lord. Yeah. yeah. No, you, you definitely gotten better with age. Yeah, there was. Dude, it's your cousin, style. My cousin Tina posted her wedding picture that was from like back 20, in, I don't yeah, even know how long ago. 25 years ago, something like that. And you saw it. You know, Dad. Yeah, he was mustache. this little, tiny, skinny, I didn't have like anorexic looking yeah. thing. Like, I was literally bigger than him. Yeah. He was so <laughs> skinny. Literally, he wore a smaller size pants than I did. Jesus. <laughs> That's it's how true. skinny he was. <laughs> and I true. see this now, it's and I'm like, oh, man. Like what? The Did you ever look and be like, "Damn, that's my man right there"? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where you had to like, like second guess you, yourself. Like, yeah. I was like, "Wow, you look a lot better now, honey." <laughs> Get some meat on them bones. Exactly. Right. Honestly, the people. He was so skinny. People so probably tight. thought that you were like uh, a revolutionary oh lesbian. lesbian couple. <laughs> I can see it. I can see Except for oh when he had God. the stand. No, I will say that no, literally. Yeah, still I will lies. say that this is true, Laura. You know this. When we were young in our twenties, I would say at least fifty percent of the That's time good. when a, oh a, a server came up, they would call us "mams." Both of us. He would sister so, her. Yeah. No, yeah. when oh, we miss, were what in, would you like? When we were in Key West because I didn't have <laughs> facial hair. You know, yeah. I didn't have facial hair. Oh yeah, Key we West. Were in yeah, Key West. We're walking and guy walks. She was eight months pregnant. And grabs his ass. Yeah, it's guy so came up and grabbed my ass. I'm oh right my in the middle God. of the West. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. yeah so. Yeah, it was. It's, I was it's like, <laughs> it's a fun it, life. <laughs> what the drive-throughs? You get called like honey and yeah. stuff. Oh yeah. yeah, that happened. That was yeah, the other thing, happened. dude. Yeah. I'm telling you, he's a rock star. Like yeah. people don't even know his name, but they like will hit on him. Yeah. Give him well, free shit. Yeah. Mainly. Now, are they hitting on you? Because it's mainly men. But yeah, it's mainly men. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I forgot to clarify. Yeah, it's all men. No, 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 never yeah. women, <laughs> never <laughs> women, <laughs> never women. But the guys, I, they like, they well, like. Let me I tell you, though. I got a little you sugar in me. You know what men. I mean? So lucky. A little, <laughs> no, I'm just a little sugar. Just in me. <laughs> My brother is gay, so you know. It's, so it's, is mine. It's in the, is it? No, Jesse's called. Jesse, Sorry, Jesse. Jesse. <laughs> no, yeah. no, he's not. Yeah. He's not. I no, love it's Jesse. It's in the family. Yeah. It's, in, it's in the family. Nice. What's this six 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 super chat up there? He shares I don't with know, you, right? but Sherry says yes. Bring the turtle. Uh, what's this? Soul is honky. Yeah, he said on uh, nice. Let's see. Love from the devil in Portland. Same thing. Noah's story happened to me with Expedia. Oh, this, yeah, they, they canceled like, yeah, on canceled you. Canceled on something like that. Oh no! Um, I'm sorry to hear that, man. Yeah, yeah man, that, that sucks. sucks, dude. Six six six, right there, bro. Why do you have to use that six 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 for? Uh, sex CS bot. says, "I uh, love the pro- uh, CF production. Ban the, the sex podcast. bots." 
Yeah, you know, we get a lot of that, unfortunately. It's, uh, it's Cali nice. Reptiles, good luck this weekend, guys. Actually, it's going to be great with the Open for us, and good mm. luck with you, uh, Miguel, at uh, Tinley. I thought uh, I was staying here. Staz, uh, yeah, Brodowski, love the vids. <laughs> right. Thank you so much. I'll put you to work. Yeah. <laughs> I'll get Dude, you a Reptarium shirt. I'm so <laughs> down Stacey for that. Lee, love you guys. Today is my hey, birthday. Hey, Stacey, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. You're okay. one day closer to death. Woo! Cheers. Cheers. Stacey. Dude, you guys are from vicious, dude. Stay safe from the corona out there, Stacy. <laughs> All right, that's it. You so, know what uh, I want to get back to, honestly? Um, what's that? Let's do it. Oh Honey God. mustard? No. Honey <laughs> mustard. <laughs> You're back in the day outfits. Dude, how can we get you to wear that again? Dude, Bro, I've been trying I to get you to. Brian, yeah. I swear, what outfit? dude. Which outfit? Okay, are you I remember well, one. one. Yeah, the cargo yeah. pants. It had like the like the ties, like yep, little things yep, like yep. just yep. hanging. We got yeah. those. He had, a, yeah. he had a big old like death metal shirt on, just long yeah. and faded. It was black, but it was so faded. And then like the New Balance shoes, yeah. With, like, and then the white, socks, white, white, white socks, white socks, white socks. Yes. yes. <laughs> What's the name of the shirts, Dad? UFC fighters. UFC, yeah. Yeah. Affliction. Affliction. That was That's definitely what they were. you, dude. Yeah, yeah. Because at the time we were he so big guy. into UFC, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Was and like. Man. If yeah. you were a UFC fan, you had to you wear a flip shirt. You were a yeah. You had yeah. to. Yeah. Yeah. It's I not remember like that. You used to rock all those. Yeah. Or tap, tap out. out. Yeah. Tap yeah. out was big. <laughs> you were one of those bros he for was. sure. With the New Balance. Yeah. <laughs> yes, with yes. oh, yeah. the New Balance. Oh, yeah. <laughs> had a Brian, band. I, didn't I, I don't swear, do dude, I would do anything just to throw a, like an old school like outfit on. Just for one day. Just one day. I would want to take that one day. It would be great. We can get that. You might bring it back. I mean, think about it. We can bring out the Nike Monarchs. My grandpa oh, yeah. has a pair. All yes, the he old does. school. But that's yeah, like yeah. what the dad shoe is. Yeah. Well, so, so the interesting like thing is like New Balance brick. is actually pretty hip now. You know, New well, you Balance know isn't funny? bad at all. I follow like this. Monarchs. Yeah, I'm you curious. I want to see that. Oh, you'll, you'll recognize them. Are they the dad the, shoe? Get the white the <laughs> yes, yes, white, white, white ones. Those. Yes, yes, dude, yes. That's the dad you starter pack. Literally, we bought that. We bought that every year. It was either that or the New Balance. Those were the two we yeah. we we flip flopped. That's it, baby. Every Whoa. birthday or Christmas. Okay, it's all about Brett, comfort. But you yeah, have you know. to say you have to thank the reptile community to push you away from this to do this. Yeah, bro. It wasn't the the rep- them now. No, it wasn't the reptile no. community. It was the YouTubers. Oh yeah, YouTubers, yeah. 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 The reptile community let up. them have but, that. But yeah. I died, so I follow this uh, this thing on uh, Instagram. It's called the Dad. Hilarious! Yeah. If you want, do they have laugh. pictures of Brian it's, on there? No, 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 no. But but this is the thing now. So new dads, that's oh, what yeah. they do. And literally, they have the tan cargo shorts, a shirt, and those New Balance shoes. And they like have a picture of them holding their newborn yeah. baby. Like do they the really? Dad, yes, the dad yeah, starter awesome. pack. It's like as they're holding the baby coming yeah. out of the hospital. I cried. oh my god! I it's like the first it's, time I saw that. I was like, yeah. oh my god, dude! You could be the spokesman. Think about. It. I know, man. I could go <laughs> back, man. It's I a new. Feel I feel a calling. <laughs> Dude, you were awesome. I've been yeah. trying to get you to wear like a cowboy hat or something. <laughs> no. But now I'm no. leaning towards Pain. a Blinken hat. Pain. All right, oh, so Jesus. paying for I <laughs> it's like, Brian I said, pronoun- mispronounced my name. I said Cali Reptile. What is it? Oh, no, it's not it's Cali Cal- Reptile. It's Cal-El Reptile. It's Cal- Cal- Cal-El. Cal- oh, I didn't see the L. Cal-El Like, you know, Superman? You- Cal-El? Oh, yeah. I'm just taking a big guess. I would I'm say sure. Cali. I'm sorry. You that, said, I got you, man. Look at this guy. He said, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're right. just bullshitting. Just totally, <laughs> like if I was right. <laughs> you caught on to it. Nice oh, try. Yeah. Nice try. Hey, Brian, yes, well uh, with it. what's better, Lori, with or without wine? It depends. You know what? You know, I'm it good depends. both ways. I will it say depends. with. Yeah. <laughs> my experience of <laughs> with <laughs> wine. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Sorry, sorry. It depends what's going on. You know what exactly. I mean? Exactly. It's like, you know, yeah. there's times where it could go both Dude, ways. Here's a funny story about Lori real quick. Okay. Uh-oh. Remember when I came here the last time and I was like, hey, what's up, big dog? Remember I was like, so what's up, big dog here? And I'll try and get it. Oh, I'm I like, remember this. I'm like, Laura, what's up, big dog? She looks at me like, no. And I was like, <laughs> <laughs> walked right yeah, out, dude. Yeah, like, she's not- stop me cold on my yeah. track. And I thought at this time, it was like my third time being here. I was comfortable. Yeah. I'm like, I'm in. I'm in for sure. What's yeah. up, big dog? And she looked at me so and I was like, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Exit out. <laughs> yeah, just keep on walking. Just yeah. keep on least, walking. At least the thing I appreciate about you is you know when to walk away. Oh, well, dude, like, the look alone. I'm not going to well, stay there and try to get the what? big dog I'm going to tell you something. Some people don't see the look. And some people still try to come at me. I'm like, are you kidding are you me right now? Oh, you. Yeah. yeah. If that then look doesn't just, tell you yeah, to move away, 
too. You're, you're missing there, a couple of screws. And there's yeah. been a few where I'm like, are you fucking kidding me Dude, right now? I remember <laughs> Brian just looks at me. He's like, he's like, yeah, just come on. He's like, yeah. <laughs> I'm your big dog. I do the And then I he tries to chastise yeah. yeah, me. He tries to chastise me. Lori, you should be nice. I'm like. Laurie's <laughs> <laughs> no, <I'm sorry>. <laughs> not, not the cute and cuddly one of the two. You know what I mean? I'm like the affectionate guy. You know, yeah. and gotta he's, have balance. He's, he's the nice guy. Dude, he's the real Brian nice guy. Is, I told dude, I'm you. Yeah. Brian is nice. super nice. Like I'm I not know. lying. He's, no. I know. Sometimes it really yeah. makes me sick. Really? Yeah. She doesn't want me to be nice. <sighs> yeah, but I think <laughs> <laughs> sometimes it happens. You just have to be mean. Like, it depends. I got. I've got my side. Trust me. You do. Yeah. It, I've it never takes a seen lot, it. But when oh, it no. takes oh, a lot. When, oh, when I snap, when I snap, I snap. That's the thing. It takes a lot. <laughs> oh man. You see that I got a story. <laughs> I got he's a story actually of, shared a story oh, with no, me. Before. He's Jesus. actually shared a story with me. I have oh, one story. This is real quick. It's honestly oh, not that bad. You're oh, you're no. gonna think I'm gonna say something worse. It's not that okay, bad. Okay, let's do it. But um, so an angry dad. <laughs> There's okay. not a whole lot. Of There's these not stories, a whole lot of no. them. But I will say at our old building on Shelby, the biggest building that you guys have ever had. Yep. There was a lot of doors in that building. <laughs> yeah. A lot of wooden doors. Yeah. Okay, but they weren't hard wood. They were. The, the cheap, the cheap kind, hollow you know, ones, and the yeah. hollow ones. And uh, let's just say if something went wrong, I don't know, breeding wrong or somebody got in an argument ever and, you know, tempers would flare up a little bit. Let's just say he was busting down that fucking door, <laughs> putting his whole arm through the door, <laughs> kicking the door wait, down. Wait, 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 wait. No, yeah. Dad started pack Brian. Dad started oh, pack yeah. Brian. No. New, new balance Dude, through the no. fucking door. Yeah. You just new just, balance shoot right through. <laughs> Dude. What's a new balance doing? Dude, what? Jay, do, do me a favor. Pull no. up. No. Pull up. I, I can't see pull that. Pull up Rampage Jackson punching oh, doors. When he starts killing that. That's, yeah. that's literally him. <laughs> that, I know what you're talking when, about. Not anymore. Like, when, not not anymore. anymore. Not well, anymore. Well, I've learned to not be violent. Really breaks when door. He, yeah, 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 yeah. Punching door. The oh my is, god! This it takes is, a lot that to yeah. make Brian snap, but when he snaps, really, he'll yeah. Snap. Oh my well, god! Well, you know, you get it pent up and stuff. Okay, like so that's that. that's Brian right yeah. there. Yeah, yeah, this is Brian, Brian with a really good team. Yeah, exactly. Throws <laughs> yeah. water I bottle. I want to fight you, Brian. Nice Timberlands. <laughs> Throws there water bottle. Really. He's like, "Fuck this shit!" Oh, <laughs> <laughs> stupid fucking Lori! Oh, dumbass! Oh, why didn't you bring my snakes right? Oh, stupid! Yeah, give me this fucking. Oh door. my god! <laughs> and guess what? You're gonna buy me a new door too. <laughs> Yeah. Did you really do that? Yeah. No. With the new balances? <laughs> with yeah. the new balances. Hell yeah. You know, There's a lot of power. This, with the <laughs> this just reminded me of something, but I want to hear this story and I want to see your reaction. I want I want to, oh, oh my gosh. Shit. This is, gonna this be is so scary, good. Man. I'm so excited about this. What's the guy that used to work here? They used to dress as um, Alice in Wonderland. Dorothy. Or Dorothy. Okay. Yeah. George. What George. was the story when you had her, when had him show up to <laughs> The cookies. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. What's All right. So true? the cookie that's party. That's totally a true. Yeah, yeah. Totally I love it. So we, so we were told. Were you in on that too? Yeah, we were all in oh, on it. Oh, yeah. I didn't know you were. I love I it. it. So we told. Cal. No, so we told George. <laughs> yeah. So every year, Lori's family my, forever. The girls yep. in my family, just my girls. cousins, just my just mom, girls. my aunt. Yes, we do a cookie exchange. Yep, yeah, cookie exchange. <laughs> they do it every year. So we told George that worked for us that we were having a cookie exchange. With the guys and everything. It was at my house. This it year. was at our Who house. Who was all in it? Who was all in it that didn't know? Oh, oh well, George I'm, was the only one that didn't George know. George and me. Oh, and, didn't and Lori. Know. Yeah, yeah. We didn't tell Lori. We just <laughs> no, told no. George. But but you like did, was it just your was like was Noah there? Anybody else I don't around? No, I just Noah think it was, was like young. I just think it was, it was all some, the guys. Okay, I just okay, think it was okay. all the guys at the crew, like Chewy and everyone point, else. We had only guys. I think maybe even Chewy might have orchestrated Chewy, it. Chewy, Lee, Kel, yeah, all of you guys. This is one of the coolest things I've ever heard, and I'm trying to get to the part where I can make this happen. It's just legendary. So we basically we tell. George, hey, there's a cookie exchange at my house. You, you sh we're all going to be there, so come. Just make sure you bring cookies. Yeah. So George walks in. Now, it's all of Lori's family, all women. Knock, knock, knock. And I answer the door. He's like, hey, what's going on? He hands me some cookies. This I'm like, hey. Best. And he just goes and goes in the basement. I'm like. Yeah, there's no one in the basement. No. He, nobody's in he the just basement. just goes down in the basement. He just goes in the basement. All of my cousins my mom are like. What's going on? I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> and like, I put the cookies down and I wait. He's just sitting in the basement. And I'm like, okay. So I go down there. I'm like, hey, what's going on? He's like, 
they tricked me, didn't they? I'm like, <laughs> you, you mean there's here? not he's there's like, not a cookie exchange for like, everybody? Oh, the crew's not coming. I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> that is so he had his mom cool. bake cookies for oh this cookie party. Oh my god! Dude. And they literally to this day, my family still talks about George coming to our cookie yeah. exchange. Dude, I'm telling you, when I heard this story, I died because I wish we I could just have like, someone do he, that. He man. did. He totally just wa- literally he walked in the door. I'm like, hey, what's going on? He hands me cookies and just goes in the basement. I'm like. What the hell's going on? Yeah. <laughs> no, did you guys let him be a part of it or did he just go no, home? He just went home. And afterwards, yeah, afterwards, when I went downstairs, she's like, oh my God. <laughs> so oh my God. And he just laughed. <laughs> you must have laughed, though. You must have we just did. cracked Oh no, up. my family's hilarious. Like I said, they're still poor like, why guy, doesn't George dude. come to our cookie exchange? Poor, poor guy. Yeah, George was just he here. Had his he mom. Just I couldn't here, believe yeah. it. He's yeah. like, I had my mom bake cookies. <laughs> <laughs> George was just here. Uh, him and Julie were here in And I told him that. I was like, dude, when you come and do our cookie exchange, <laughs> that is so cool. My family man. asked for you all the time. <laughs> That's but they old got him so bites. good. They got yeah, him old school. and they got me because both of them were all the just like, The stuff that we used to have him going? do was ridiculous, uh, you know? Dude, I go I mean, back and lick some of the stuff or something <laughs> just come up and you're just like, wow, man. It, you could have literally had like a TV, like legit series uh, around if, that if, time. Man. You know, back in the day, I mean, it, it was hell for us. You know, <laughs> yeah. I mean, looking back on it because we had such a crazy crew. But it was, it was, it was definitely reality TV based. I mean, like we, we that's what it have, was. It was reality we, TV. It based. was crazy. Yeah. I mean, we it wasn't vlog it. style. No, it was, no, it, no. Was, it, was it, was, it was reality. Yeah, it like, was horrible. Holy shit stuff. Yeah. But it no, was, I think it, it was before it's time. I think there was, now yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, <laughs> you guys just missed the window just <laughs> yeah. barely. Yeah. 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 This would have been a huge soon. MTV hit, man. Just because it was like fights and, and, you know, I mean, it was, oh my God, there was never a day that went by that wasn't like complete drama. I mean, oh, like, oh, and yeah. it wasn't fake drama. It was no, drama. Saying, it was complete but... drama. We had one guy who was a hunter with guns and like bows, and at one point, <laughs> Wild Bill went to his car to get got a gun. his bow. Yeah, well, okay. he got his bow and arrow and was trying to fucking shoot. Yeah. Chewy guys, with oh the no, bow. No, no. And I'm like, what the hell yeah. is what going on? What were you guys selling? And he, oh <laughs> know, my God. And I'm so... just like, just clean the cage for Jeez. God's sake. No, it was, what is it going was crazy. On? Yeah. Like I, so I many did. Stories. I hated it's kind of cool that going back in the day though, oh watching God. it now though. Like yeah. now what I'm going to do, I'm not going to lie. It's I'm so telling you right now, when I get back home, yeah. I'm going to do a little You're going to do it and you're going to picture me losing my mind. The, the, actually, wow. I have something better though. I'm going to just screenshot all the brand's outfits and do a vlog on it. <laughs> 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 vlog on it, yeah. <laughs> my top 10 favorite oh, Brian Barczyk yeah. outfits. Outfit. It's, it's going to always be the same shoe, yeah. same it's cargo same. shorts, yeah. just different yeah. shirt. Oh, oh man. For oh, a while though, he went for like a year wearing the blue shirt after the Brian and the Wild. Yeah, yeah, I did. Oh, that's right. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Are you gonna do another one of those, I love you. Brian in the Wild? Yeah, I, I wouldn't mind. You That'd know, be I mean, cool. I think you know we've been Why talking do you about. Go? Yes, but I have a good idea. But I think we should do like tell- Brian in the Wild, no, wild narco status, and we go to Mexico. <laughs> oh man, down oh, to well, you know, we're talking about it's we're 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 literally Tina, talking no. about no, yeah, no. Tina, no. <laughs> we're literally talking about doing a Mexico trip here. Uh, this I was just summer. playing. No, no, for <laughs> sure. So, but to do the Yucatan with my buddy uh, Victor down there, where it's like just off the beaten path, where we just take like ten days and just go out and just hit shit that you know, no one goes to, you know what I mean? That'd Just be like, really cool. I yeah, it'd be really go. cool. I don't think you can go because they won't let you back. Yeah, it'd be like, <sighs> yeah. Well, I would, I mean, the thing about, I just got that. I was like, wait. <laughs> I was like, it. I was wait focusing what I was going to say. I was like, wait, did you tell me I won't come back? That's, that's actually my video that I'm going to do. I want to surprise Miguel with a, a green card. Dude, I need one. Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. We yeah. should do one. tomorrow's video. Did I yeah. tell you guys? I started a, uh, a uh, Spanish Yes, channel. I think that's awesome, though. And Seriously, I get demolished I all the time because my Spanish is horrible. Oh, really? Yeah. Did you? No, they've been very it's supportive. It's better than mine, though. It's better than mine. Dude, you'd be surprised. Yeah. Dude, oh. I do this a lot when I'm vlogging. Hey, un momento. Siri, how do you say <laughs> this? <laughs> all the time. No, all the time. no lie, dude. And, and people just dog dude, me. Dude, and trust me, that thing is fucking wrong. Because oh, yeah. in my Spanish class, I would do that all the time. My teacher's like, you're an idiot. This, this is not yeah. even Mexican. Mexican. Yeah. Spanish. Wow. Not Mexican, wow. Noah. How do you, you know how to say uh, ball pythons and... Uh, Mex- in Spanish. <laughs> no, <laughs> he did it too. No, it's in the air. I didn't even know how to do it either. What is it? It's piton bola. 
Biton bala. Biton bala. Biton bala. I thought it was bola. Yeah, because it makes a sense. Yeah, because it's well, the they, verb in the yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah. So it's always exactly. that. But then I always knew culebra was you know um, I was like I was calling them culebras, which is growing up to me that's what a snake was. But no, culebra means snake out in the wild, wild snakes, oh, right? Yeah. Okay. Now an actual snake is called serpiente. Serpiente. like serpent right yeah, yeah and that's what sense. we that's the con so i was you know it's kind of cool but all of the genetics is the same way we say them out here oh, orange yeah. stream right. yellow but that's yeah. the way they call right. america so, like yeah, yeah. yeah you know but you know the problem do you have too is i noticed like okay so there's formal spanish and yeah. then there's the so slang i have or slang i have right. slang spanish exactly. and they have like yeah. Like I was learning all these things because I can't write it, but you know, just stuff. There's this guy, um, what's it called, uh, David from uh, Asa the Exotics. He's been helping me. He's the one that's been pushing me. He just started a YouTube. He's been doing this YouTube channel. He's killing it out there, yeah, man. Yeah, that's great. And um, he's the one that made me do it. But like, I always mess him. Hey, how do I put this down? <laughs> how do I say this? Because I look at some of the comments and I'm like, damn, delete, <laughs> delete, yeah. delete. You guys are worse than the states, dude. Oh, but yeah, it, but it's crazy though because um, leopard idea, geckos. Though. And like ball pythons out there are so like yeah. big right now. It's yeah. growing like crazy. Yeah. You know, I actually yeah. have my first shipment now going to Mexico. I'll be like one yeah, of the first out there. Awesome. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. Super cool. You know who's the only person that ships out there? Who's that? It's Kevin. Kevin really yeah. is. He's, you know, he's the big market out there. Well, you Mexico. know, I wonder because Kevin um, went to Mexico City. I was supposed to go to Mexico City. Animalia. I, I think, and and I called, I, I just didn't want to go, some things happened, whatever it was. Sick. And I called in Kevin and I said, Kevin, do you want to go in my place? And he went down there about five years ago. So I wonder if that was like so the start of his that's, thing. That's how it all started. Yeah. So um, now that I've, you know, I've, I've done a couple of things there and I've done some things with the guy and they talk about three people. Kevin right now is like, cause he's the one that went over there. He yeah. was a celebrity host sure. there. Yeah. Um, you are the next one. And then uh, Savannah Bone well, from Gatorland. Oh, sweet. Spanish and then uh, uh, Jay from Prehistoric. Like okay. they're like, just you like the, like, I haven't made it there yet. Yeah. yeah. Working Damn. on your Spanish. I never yeah, yeah. do no more Spanish <laughs> vlogs. Yeah. No more. No, I was like, yeah. But yeah, so they're like, they always say like, oh, snake bites. It's not, so that's why tomorrow I want to do like a vlog for them and everyone because yeah, they're excited no, about it. Yeah, it's super cool. No, I think it's a great thing. You know, I mean, obviously, um, you know, I think it, it, if I could speak Spanish, I would do it because I think it's really good. As a matter of fact, you know, like, like even Jay, no, it just I think it's good to have bilingual <laughs> content. Uh, Jay from wait, Prius. Whoa, wait a minute. There was too much of a pause, a stare. What, what, I know. No what was going to be said? What was, gonna what be was said? going on in the yeah. mind? Because, that because face was he, so said, funny. he said, if I could speak Spanish, I couldn't. And I laugh because you can. You do. <laughs> You, oh, have, you, yeah, yeah. you just don't want to. No, yeah. no, trust me, no. you can't. Because I, I can't. can't. I can't. <laughs> no, like, yeah, you I, can't. No, 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 Anybody no. can Listen, learn. You just Listen, have to learn. No, I will say this is, is I yes, you have to learn. But I don't think my brain can do it. Dude, my brain can't do it. And that yeah. was my first language. You know what I catch myself doing? I'll just try to throw an accent. Like, I'm like, oh, breeding. I'm like, uh, el breeding. <laughs> that, is, that is the whitest thing you can do. I do that all the time. Do. And I'm just like, damn, I just did that. I just, just did that. You just add an L yeah. to it. It was L. so, exactly. And I'm like, hey. Hey. And you know and, what I think yeah. about? Like, when people, like, in, like, just TV shows or something, like, they, they try to mimic uh, someone yeah. to speak in Spanish. And I'm like, dude, I, I was just that guy. I was just that yeah, guy. Yeah, you were. But it's like, it's so frustrating because I'll, I'll be on the camera and like and I'll say some words and I'm like nope I didn't say it right yeah and it's it's kind of hard but it's actually you know getting me um it's it's brushing up my I think, Spanish no, I think it's sure. a good yeah. idea I'm gonna catch up real quick here Alexander Lizard uh hundred sec I re I can't remember Swedish. That's, that's Swedish I remember that again I remember that from thank before you. thank you thank Katie you. uh Laurie has the mo most beautiful RBF what is RBF most epic, epic. Oh, epic. RBF <laughs> I know Oh, oh <laughs> damn, Jay, you came in clutch. Oh, well, thank you. And yeah. yes. thank, you, thank you and fuck you. Uh, <laughs> no, no, no. I, oh, I that's Turtle. Oh, oh shit, hey. Turtle. Hey. See, we finally got some of Miguel's <laughs> money on the city. <laughs> yeah. Good look at that, Turtle. <laughs> turtle, next no, time. Now, Turtle, I will say this. Good. Laurie didn't want you to come, but babe, no, thank you very much. I want you, to bring you in the family. You are a liar. Like, no. And if she was listening, she knows you're for not sure welcome again. Yeah. Without so next her. time turtle comes for the podcast right. or she Miguel can come alone home. and you stay no. home yeah yeah, yeah. really no, yeah, no. yeah. Yeah. Dude, I have two kids. 100%. Have you guys had two exactly. kids? Exactly. Well, we did yeah. have two kids. You yeah. don't yeah. We did have two kids. Have two kids. <laughs> <laughs> no, but a yeah, girl and did. a boy? Yeah. Yeah, we oh, did. Same. Oh, yeah. 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 Really. yeah. We do have that. Yeah. Same. Uh, no, excuse me. All right, Turtle. 
Go See you buy, in the next podcast. <laughs> See you in the next go, podcast. Go buy a pair of New Balance and man up. <laughs> that I will never do. <laughs> Brian, no, please no. do it. <laughs> Brian, what do I st- You know what we should do? Oh my gosh, Let's I'm telling you. Let's you and it. I should go shopping tomorrow. Let's and do it. And both buy New Balance? I swear. And then Let's like get the cargo shorts. Shit. Yes. Get the long death metal shirt. And we'll like wash it eight times like in the day yeah. just to get it like faded. Yeah. And then throw those New Balances. Can we dress you up though? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. No, no, yeah, I'm going to buy you a button up flannel. No, and a white no, no, no. <laughs> and some high white socks. Yeah, he's backing you up. And some, and some, right. low, to, and some low top, yeah, low dude. top Converse. Oh, no, snap. Nike Cortez. Nike Cortez. Nike Cortez. Nike Cortez yes, go, that'll dude. be too. Oh, that would be so. Like a little, uh, and a little bandana. Yes. And the bandana. Think about it. No, the bandana. Yeah. Think about it. BHB and together. AP go throwback. Oh, dude, yeah. That'd be really cool. I like it. I like the idea, man. That'd be really cool. That'd be awesome. So Tinley's this weekend. Yeah. We're actually having Potter on here in the next couple of weeks for the podcast. No way. So yeah. we all know that the the highlight, I mean, for me anyways, one of the highlights was always the auction, right? The Dude. auction's fun. Uh, that is something I, I do f- miss. funny auction story we can get to yeah. later. Yeah. That is something I do miss, though. Did I, I do take miss you to an auction? Oh, I've been to a Daytona auction. I know oh, it's not, Daytona. I know it's not. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, no, yeah, I will yeah, say this. I forgot. Like, so. Yes. You were Friendly at Daytona. auctions yeah. are, you can't compare It wasn't, them, it right? wasn't the yeah. pizza box one, was no, it? No, no, no. Oh, that was, this is me and Chad. This is me and Chad. Oh, God. With the fake poop. That was yeah, that we'll, was a very bad. We'll get to that. I yeah. love yeah. Oh so, my God. dude. That is cool that you're having them out here. That's gonna be really really yeah, cool. Yeah. So I, I always find it interesting is that you know obviously you know we always say you know this isn't really a reptile podcast as you know we haven't talked it's much not? about reptiles. Oh, um, and and yeah. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> but you know we, we obviously do reptiles for a living. We love <laughs> reptiles, and so we it's our through story. You know, but it's all I always find it interesting that with the reptile podcast, really no one has Potter on. And he's no, a pretty he's, major influential dude. person in the reptile business. I don't know how um, much you know him or how much you've you hung know what? out with uh, him. We've, we just, we got really close like the last year when yeah. he started insulting me and my friend at the auctions. We yeah, got that's, really close. That's when you know. Isn't that's funny because yeah. that's when you bond. Yeah, I was like, like oh. Exactly. And then I'll see him at the bar. I'm like, hey man, he's like, where's Kenny? And I'm like, okay, so I'm not what you said I was. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, Potter, Potter's no, a really cool he's guy. He's funny, man. dude. We've known him <laughs> forever. I mean, for 30 years or whatever. Before they even started the So he's a He's a no character. Way. Yeah. Oh yeah. Way before yeah. the NARBC. Yeah. We knew yeah. him. Oh wow. Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah. So yeah. he's been in the reptile industry like oh, just before yeah. the yeah. NARBC oh, thing yeah. started happening. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Wow. That's insane. Yeah. yeah. He used to you know breed snakes. I mean that was like he had his pet shop, his Chicago pet shop, Reptile yep. House, and and he bred snakes. And he was uh, good friends with Peter Call. You know. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, and and um, I think we might have met him through Peter actually. I think so yeah. Yeah. And so um so yeah it's just you know Potter's a good guy so he's going to be on but he makes the auctions pretty entertaining you know dude to uh, say the least yeah, yeah. well think <laughs> about it. I used to go, say anything right I used to just go to the Pomona ones all the time and yeah like, oh, I used to, I thought they were cool it's like wait to go to Tinley yeah and when you meet Potter it's like a whole different monster yeah and I mean you really Literally, don't understand you nailed that whole different yeah when you monster. get there that and you start getting your rubber bands <laughs> gummy worms like boom boom you're like looking about who's throwing them at you yeah. but it's a very good like like i love the auctions yeah. you know i think it's at the end of the day it's you know for a good you know cause yeah us but... is amazing i mean you know we're, we 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 love it and it, it's a good thing they raise money but we have a good time doing it yeah and, exactly. I, and that's something i do miss you know a lot not being at those uh, i've thought about coming you know I this know. year you know they're actually having a benefit for forest as yeah. well at the auction and um and des so that Man. that's something i wish i, I wasn't missing it, it i will say this if it wasn't for the fact that this is our grand opening weekend you would have been i would there. come at least 100%. for the auction yeah. and yeah. the fundraiser um unfortunately i mean we we just literally you we can't. got you know vip party <laughs> till midnight there's no way i can be in chicago um so it, it's kind of a bummer so it, it, that's it one thing up. right is that i was because we used to do so many shows right and i oh, was yeah. and i was All there for a lot of them but um you know, I was a kid, and I, you know, it was one thing I was looking forward to. Were the it was like, oh no, no, no! When I get older, this is gonna be a lot more fun because then I'll be able to partake with all the shenanigans. <laughs> but yeah. then we're not in it anymore, so I, I never get to experience oh, that you can side come of with things. Me this yeah, you can come hang out. Yeah, no, know, he's, he's needed here. I know, <laughs> yeah, he's needed here. This but, weekend, no, I, I don't think I'm not gonna say we're Maybe never gonna day. be back. I mean, I'm sure I'll be back at some point. Yeah. You know, out of nostalgia and stuff like that. I mean, I still, you know, no, obviously like there's people said, I love. You know, exactly. You know what? We had friends that for years that was the whole thing. Like that's what we looked forward to was hanging out with our friends that we've known forever and 
you know what I mean? Stuff like that and the people that we would see. So no, there's a lot we miss. There's, you know, we don't miss the bullshit, well, but right. there's more good stuff that, yeah, I will, I will say this though, like just now from seeing, you know, I, I, I go to all the shows, right? Yeah. The the bad people in the in the industry are like weaning out like completely. Yeah. Well, I well, told I, no, it's a big difference. You have yeah. no. We were just talking about it. It's like it makes sense too because once once the big money leaves, then those assholes leave. Yeah, you know what they, I mean. They don't understand how important that <laughs> big money person is because you know? you're doing it for the animals and the love, which is what you should be you doing know, it for anyways. So if, so check this out. I just started yeah. doing shout outs for like for example um, Arlington. I'm like oh Arlington uh, yeah. roll call. All the breeders are going to, not all of them, I'll pick like five, seven breeders, right? Tinley, I did it again. And in the beginning, people are saying, oh, this guy's just doing YouTube, blah, blah, blah. And the same people, the same people that were talking smack about yep. me are now calling me, hey, man, could I be on part shout of that thing? Are you going to shout me out for that? <laughs> yeah. And to me, it's like, I, I honestly, I'll, I'll do it regardless. You know, if I forget or, you know, I'll, I'll go out to show and I'll yeah. just show because with me or people like, oh, why are you shouting this person? I shouldn't be a competition. I don't think it's a competition. There's not enough no. people to breed ball pythons that, you know, support everyone. But the sure. problem is, Everyone just talks about, you know, just themselves. They want to keep their own customers to themselves, but that's yeah. what kills the industry. Yeah. But little by little, when I'm noticing it, it's growing and growing and growing and getting bigger and bigger. And yeah. again, like I'm blessed to be a part of this industry, even though I, the first year was very like hell for me. Mm -hmm. But if it wasn't for me jumping into like, you know, doing what you're doing, becoming friends with you and just doing the whole influencer thing, breeding thing, I would have never experienced the things I've done the last three years that I haven't done in what, 32 years. Yeah. In life. Well, I, I think it is. And this is the thing yeah. I've said it, you know, basically, uh, and I, I had mentioned when you started coming onto the scene. I took a lot of heat off of you. Yeah, thank God. No, <laughs> no, 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 not at all, not at all, not at all. Not at all. <laughs> but, um, you know, I think what happens is, you know, people emulate people that they perceive to be successful or they want to be like. And what happened was, and I, I, I'm going to say it, and um, if it gets out there that I've said it, fuck it, I don't care. Uh, you know, Ralph Davis, years ago, when he came onto the scene was the first person that started attacking people right prior yeah. to ralph there was really nobody like breeders respected each I don't know other who ralph is. no 100 so, percent. well because he's not really in yeah anymore, he, he's back in a back little in bit but day. but yeah. ralph but but i will say ralph did it mainly out of number one he didn't make things up about people he was honest yeah and number two he did it mainly out of almost like <laughs> joking slash like slapstick type of stuff but but ralph went came from like no like hardly anybody to, to being one of the biggest names in the yeah. business overnight and a lot of it was because the internet was just going myspace and and, yep. and stuff like Dude, that was just hitting. myspace yeah and and so he was crushing it yeah it? he no. was i think it is yeah yeah, yeah so he was he was <laughs> Look crushing me up, it dude. i still have a page <laughs> I, I think i still have my blink when they did two songs that i had on there exactly, my ones, exactly. <laughs> so so ralph was crushing it back then because he was controversial and it was the first thing and so really that's what, what attracts uh, right. people though oh well, right and, and so, that was the thing people realized that and right then more well, right and then what ended up happening that, yeah. quite frankly and again i'm going to call him out because i don't care because it doesn't matter is brock wagner happened you know oh. brock wagner actually came in and he took what ralph did by calling people out but he did it viciously and he did it by making stories up about people and saying lies about people and uh, to gain popularity. And he did very well, right? I mean, he went from, again, being someone that no one knew about to being a pretty major name in the business pretty quickly with that mentality of talking bad about people. And instead of saying, you should deal with me because I've got great animals and price and service, he would say, don't be able to deal with Barcheck because he's got mites and, and his stuff is dying and he's going to fuck you over right that's what he would say and uh and and then with his success other people emulated him just like he it's emulated kind of ralph yep. and so my point is reason wrapping this up you came on the scene and i think you were kind of the new guard that basically people said wait a second I can be successful and still like people and be and nice and not talk shit about people <laughs> and, and be willing to, to promote other people that are my competition. Well, there right? was people that talk shit about me. It's just when I knew the sure. person, I said, okay, when I see you, I'm going to slap you across right. the face, yeah, you yeah, know, yeah. And because there's a lot of people. I just, I just couldn't believe the stuff but that was going on. you weren't talking shit about people. No, yeah, you weren't. You were, yeah, that was the thing. You had this positive. You weren't following the yeah. same thing as everybody else. Like, okay, so I got to dog this guy so they don't spend yeah, money with him. Like, I just got to be me and just, do my thing and, and yeah. just in like in this world just in general though it's kind of sad though that the whole negativity the 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 shit talking the bashing people 
generates more attention than the sure. positive I, outlook of things. I, I, like I don't that. get it. I hate man. that about society right like, now. That that's how people are. Like I, that's what they live for. Yeah, I like some of my like, like videos, and I remember I would tell Brian, I'm like, hey man, and the, 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 the dude, it's so crazy because you have such a like a loyal following. Sometimes I'll leave comments on your thing, like when you post the thing on there, and like you leave Brian alone, it's like. Oh damn! You don't like, you're not know that we're friends. Yeah, we're right. Yeah. Even when I would do a title like things that are wrong with Brian Barchick, yeah. I'm like Brian, I need some of that clout. I need yeah, some yeah, of those yeah. views. My YouTube's doing yeah. bad, and then it's like people don't even bother watching the vlog. They'll no, just say, yeah, "They just look at the you title. Are, how could you asshole. talk about Brian?" How could, but then you look at the views and everything. It's like, wow, that's sad. When I could do a video where I'm like, "Hey, I'm over here checking out Brian's collection," and yeah, they and won't it even get, do yeah, yeah. a quarter of the amount yep. of well, me that's bashing. Really, him. That's why people don't understand that, you know. Uh, and it's and it's funny. Like, let's say David Dobrik. I mean, his brand is clickbait, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, PewDiePie, which is one of the most successful YouTubers on the planet, uh, will always say he's the king mm -hmm. of clickbait. You know, he's like, I, you know. PewDiePie will say like when someone says, "Oh, he's better clickbaiter," he will get he'll be like, "No one's a better clickbaiter than me," you yeah. know. And and so it's funny when people will kind of attack us about clickbait. When you sit back and go, "Well, that's what works, right?" That's what so YouTube's it's it's about. the idea. Do you want to <laughs> do you want to stay? Do you want to have a generic title that no one watches, or do you want to have a title and a thumbnail that people watch? And then the message within that. It's supposed to be good, yeah. right? And to me, that's what makes sense. But, but my point, you know, wrapping that whole thing up is just I think it's good that a lot of people are now emulating you. Yeah. Um, and you see, like JP, you know, I mean, there's a, a whole number of people. Good role model. Yeah. People are following. Oh. No. Oh. Wait, what? there he goes, Laurie Jr. over here. <laughs> no, but, but I think it's that's a better thing. What I'm saying is we, I, that that's only going to be good for the hobby to have good people that have good you know, kind of uh, business sense to them to realize that you don't, you know, again, all ships rise with the tide. That's why I don't mind helping my friends and other people grow their social following because by me helping you, uh, not that I'm helping you, but if I, when I do, it, it doesn't hurt me, right? Yeah. It doesn't hurt me to have you. I would love nothing more than your YouTube to blow up and your social to blow up. When I see you hitting close to 200K on Insta, I'm not jealous. I'm like, cool. That's awesome. My friend. You've has always been pay. like that, though. Yeah. But there's a lot of people that are opposite. Of and that, and it know? goes again to the reptile thing. I hate bringing it up. But, you know, if, for example, if someone calls me for a snake, right? Mm -hmm. I'd be like, oh, man, I don't have it. But so and so does. But the general community and they're like, no, nope, I don't have it. You know, but right. you don't want to buy from there. You don't want to buy from this guy. Yeah, this guy has that's that. This guy crazy. Has that. And that's what kind of what my whole outlook on it. it's like, dude, if I don't have it and I could vouch for so and so and so and so. And it's like now that I've been doing this for like hard on on the community side of the mm -hmm. reptile industry i noticed more closure and people that do not like each other actually getting along a lot better Good. people are giving more shout outs because they're following the whole thing and honestly at the end of the day i think this is going to help this industry because i think this industry has a chance to be what you could have made it really really be back in the day but yeah. the problem is is everybody was just you know just belittle and yeah. you bashing you which yeah, they didn't realize thing, how you know? good yeah. it could have no you have brian yeah. I'm, I'm sure you know you know man you could have made this industry be where i think it should be and that's like yeah. to the top well, it man. was really weird that like i said i mean that was always my vision right my vision was what people don't understand is that you know now i'm so you know i'm so enthralled with the reptarium and the educational side and that's what my passion is that's where all of my energy is but for 27 years my sole purpose was to grow the reptile business. You know, not my reptile business, but the hobby. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I wanted to, like, I woke up in the morning and all I thought about was how could I reach more people with this awesome hobby of breeding snakes, being involved. Um, and and it, it, it is a bummer that now that passion on my side is gone. And it's gone because it was, <laughs> you know, taken away, you know, it, it, we made the decision, but I still feel like it was taken away because I was forced, listen, I couldn't be a player in that world anymore, right? I was smart, I'm a smart enough guy to understand that it doesn't work when all these people are, I mean, there's people waking up in the morning and just trying to decide how could they tear down BHB, right? Yeah. Yeah. And, and, and that was just the reality. I mean, you know, there was a period of time, where, and this is a long time ago, two, three years ago, where I couldn't post a post on any platform without getting hate. Every single post I'd made on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, uh, YouTube, there would be hundreds of people hating on it. And it, it, it was it was draining. It was draining yeah. to have that happen. So I had to make a decision to change my life. And like I said, in, in reality, it was the best decision I ever made. I'm the happiest I've ever been. Um, 
this is the best direction we've ever been in as a family as far as things and and uh but it but there's always going to be that part of me that loves the reptile hobby because well, of course because know. it's still part of it yeah you know yeah. and that's the whole thing is and i'm happy to hear that and i hope it continues because that's yeah. what i say all the time is Back when I first met him and, and just started getting into the hobby per yeah. se, which was at its infancy at that point, yep. you know, everybody, like it was all common interest. Yeah. These were just people getting together that loved reptiles. And you just came to get, and even though you had tables, you weren't even competing with each other. Like, you know, there wasn't any animosity like, you know, okay, yeah, yeah. I have gray bands, you have gray bands and you sold them. We weren't mad because they bought it off your table. Like, right. you know what I mean? We yeah. were just hanging out, breeding for fun, putting the stuff out there. And that's how it was for years until yeah. all the shit happened. And then it was like, all of a sudden there's enemies, like you said, and then it's like, you. <laughs> that's, what, that's when, it, when it got shitty. <clears throat> When it was like people were selling, but then all of a sudden you hated who you sold to because now they were your competition. Yeah. Oh my gosh. And then it's like, well, what the hell is going on here? Like, we're just all doing the same thing. Like, well, you know, how do you like, do that? Like you gladly, I'll gladly take your money, but then I'll talk shit yeah, about you exactly. so people don't buy your shit. Yeah, it, it makes no, You know there, what I there mean? There was people that we were spending really good money with yeah. in the very beginning. And then when we started to breed and we would always, we would always like, not take their business. Like if someone called like, Hey, we, we, we talked to so-and-so and, and, and we'd like to know if you can help us. I'd be like, I can't, you know, if you talk to him, you got to buy from him. Yeah. That's the respect I had. Yeah. But yet that person would then all of a sudden get upset at me because I was producing. I'm like, and what I did you think I was going to do with and these that snakes? Just happened you know? so as a weird, whole, and the whole thing is, and I hope it goes back to that. It should, to where yeah. It's a community. And guess what? It's just a bunch of people who love reptiles yeah. that are doing it. And whether it buys from you. And I think, it goes from honestly when it's it's more of a hobby than a business like it, i think it gets cut well, you can still be, when yeah. people you can still, start are paying their bills and like okay yeah. i need this to be able like, to do whatever versus it's people, when money takes over your love people you people know? don't like me saying about it but i honestly consider my all my reptiles it's a straight business yeah. but i do love them though I'm, yeah. I'm, I, obviously i wouldn't yeah. be where i'm at if i didn't love them like i couldn't tell you yeah. like when i do parents at night and i wake yeah. up in the morning it's like christmas every time or yeah. when you're getting yeah. eggs and stuff like that right no. yeah. and it's the same here like you said it's not like you're seeing dollar signs no, from yeah, the stuff you're yeah. just seeing like oh my god this is awesome and then what hatches and then but you there's, know what yeah. I mean? but there's like, nothing wrong yeah. with I, but don't get off track i i think that there's nothing wrong with wanting to be financially rewarded for something that you enjoy you know what I mean? And I think that's where it becomes tricky, right? Is that people somehow think when you're financially motivated uh, that it means that you don't love what you do. As a matter of fact, I think it's the opposite. You should get financially rewarded for what you love because if you're doing something you don't love, then you're not going to enjoy it. I mean, you know? what's the American dream guess, again? Yeah. Right? yeah. Which, no, yeah. I guess it's when you take it to a nasty level. Well, like right. when you it start playing dirty, way. right? Like, yeah. okay, well, I'm going to talk shit about you. So they buy it from me instead of you like that. Yeah. That's yeah. just dirty business you know, period. Check this out, know? man. This is, this is pretty cool. We, um, so after this last shipment, I think we have a couple more things. And since in three months we sold, um, a little over 300 snakes and we're yeah, completely sold amazing. out of our snakes. Yeah, that's amazing. You know, and my thing now, it was like, I was going to do this vlog, you know, a couple things about other breeders that, you know, have like, you know, again, shouting other people out to have some sure. amazing stuff like yeah. that, you know? And I think little by little, I think that's going to make this well, whole industry. It, it makes the whole industry better, right? Because it, it for everyone. Yeah, because listen, yeah. I when I was heavily involved in it a, a few years back, there there were people I know that like got into, you know, spent hundreds of thousands of dollars on ball pythons, and a year later, literally wanted to get out of the industry because of the the vitriol that was going on. And so I sit back and I think that's so narrow minded to think that. And and um and it's like you said, if you're sold out, it's not going to hurt you if someone else buys from someone else. No, it's only going to help the industry, you know. And and people want to do well. So it's just it's a bummer. I I wish I guess you know part of my opinion of the reptile hobby is still based from two or three years ago. And I think that it is evolving to something better, something that we'd like to see. And maybe one day I'll be more involved in, in the, um, you know, in the industry again, do I think I'll ever be a big time breeder? No. As a matter of fact, I'm going the other way, you know, I'm going the other way where I want to breed less animals. Um, because like I said, I've, I've now found this unbelievable passion. I, I can honestly say that I'm more passionate about educating, 
uh, with the reptarium and other things that we then, do, even than I ever was with breeding snakes. I still love breeding snakes. I still love producing snakes, but I never had this like feeling when I wake up in the morning and I'm just like so like passionate about waking up and going to do what I do. You yeah. know what I mean? And and um, so you know, I, I still hope I'm involved in things, but uh, but I I don't see that, that I'll ever get cool back though, into man, it. That'd be cool, man, to get you back over there and like being one. Of the, I mean, you know how big that would be. I mean. Yeah. You would. Well, I think, I, you know, I'll, I'll do it. You know, I guess the, the other thing is, is that I, I sit back and I think, you know, outside of seeing friends and guys like you, we can hang out anytime. You know what I mean? Yeah. There, there's other people I'd like to meet and stuff like that, that I haven't met. But, um, but for the most part, you know, reptile shows don't, you know, I'm not buying stuff. I'm not selling stuff. Um, there's every other, you got to remember, I've said this before, like when I started snake bites, we were the only people ever filming a reptile show, right? Yeah. I think the first time that a reptile show was ever filmed for YouTube was the, uh, Anaheim NARBC back in, 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 uh, you know, 2008 holy hell you know and uh and and so we used to be the only people running around with the camera now as you know you go to tinley Dude, there's 50 people running around or 100 people filming so like why would i want to go film the same thing that everyone else because is because you're like the icon of it well i'm I gonna i'm gonna use the restroom again but yeah. real quick i want to talk to you about a <laughs> breeding um that i'm i'm close to doing okay but i want your thoughts on that because it was miguel this has to do you said you're like, oh my God, I'm hatching so many snakes, dude. Hey man, when I was out there, I signed an egg and you said I could have it. What the fuck was that snake, man? Oh, it was wait. actually something good. Oh. <laughs> Cha-ching. Cha-ching. But yeah, I'll be right back. I'm excited because hey I'm as, getting this ball uh, Let's cut. It's already <laughs> gone. He already it? sold yeah, it. <laughs> you ain't getting shit. Uh, okay, t Tim Vincent, Brian Bartrick started PAC. I don't know what Star that said. Back. A start the, the Brian Bartrick starter pack. New ah, balance starter shoes pack. Yeah, I'm in. I'm in, man. Dude, you got me, man. <laughs> and some khaki uh, shorts. So yeah, thank you, thank yeah, you for are, that. Those are the only ones. That okay, and then uh, listen, guys, we are gonna definitely we'll answer some questions with Miguel and and everyone else here in in a little bit. We'll probably talk for another yeah, not much longer. We're we're getting close, but uh, we'll we'll hang out with you guys for a little bit longer. If you have some questions at the end, we'll go through this just normal chat. Uh, get some stuff, Miguel. Uh, did a memorial vlog on Forest yesterday, the day uh, or the day before. Oh, uh, let's see. Sin Lupo, uh, I have something Siri. to say. Oh, Siri, I'm sorry. God, I'm so terrible. Siri, uh, I have something to say that I've been live watching your vids for years now and through you, I began to love reptiles. I used to be very afraid of them, but now I own several snakes and lizards. You are so inspiring and kind. Never stop. Just be yourself. Thank you so much. Seriously, your support means the world to me, uh, world to, to all of us. I mean, everything you guys do. So thank you so much, Siri. I appreciate you and um, and, and hopefully you can come visit us sometime and see the reptarium and yeah. Hang out That'd with us, awesome. but uh, uh, what what uh, there was something before that that popped up. I can't remember it what we we're talking about. Oh, okay, gotcha. No, no, that's fine. That's fine. Um, so we'll take some questions and stuff like that from Miguel, and and you know, it's it's awesome having friends. Oh, th th we we're talking. Someone was saying about the forest thing. Um, obviously, I want to do a video not only about forest, uh, but also to help the family you know, with, with, uh, some go funding things and stuff like that. Um, and someone actually commented the other day, it was, it was a little disturbing to me, to be totally honest with you. It was just like, okay, it's been five days and still no video about forest. Okay. Then, or something like kind of really derogatory. And, and, you know, honestly, guys, I'm just not ready. You know, I mean, yeah. I, you know, I'm just not I mean, ready. I'm, I'm just not ready. I, I, you know, yeah. uh, I will be soon. I will be soon, but, um, you know, it just goes again to yeah. where, like, you know, you can perceive whatever you want. But yeah. the truth of the matter is, is um, who are you, you know, well, to yeah. put that out there? Yeah. No, because the truth yeah. is, is it's you not don't, disrespecting. You don't know. Yeah, it's not disrespecting know? him to not do something no, yet. But I, but I, I, I will trust me. There'll be something done, and, and I want to do it amazing. Jay people, and I have talked yeah. about it. Jay's yeah. excited to pull a bunch of footage and. And, this um, isn't, and that's the thing, like a lot of people just, I, I'm sorry, and I'm going to go off on a thing, but I'm me and I don't give a shit, is a lot of people just go off on a thing because it's the cool thing to do. Like, oh my God, this person in the reptile community died for us. All of a sudden, I'm his best friend or, you know, blah, 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 blah. And the truth of the matter yeah. is, you know, you do you. And if you're an asshole, you're an asshole. But the truth of the matter is, Really, the family and the friends of the people who do pass away, you know, fuck you. 
if you think what you think matters and we should do something on your time, because yeah. the truth of the matter is, is when you lose somebody that you care about, yeah. you got to do what you do. Yeah. And it doesn't really when matter it's right for you. Exactly. Yeah, it's it doesn't right. matter yeah. what yeah. anybody else thinks. Like, you yeah. know, when you lose somebody close, it's a personal thing and yeah. you got to go through your own emotions. Yeah. And I don't give a shit what somebody else thinks. Mm. Well, yeah, that's all right. You know? We don't need yeah, we can well, no, it, no, I do want to say you know, it because it is bullshit. If somebody's thinking like, oh, you should do something. Yeah, well, it's just a stupid comment. It I, is, it, it, it but there's a lot of me. comments. Yeah, it but bothers me. Yeah, and yeah, that's why yeah, I'm saying yeah, it. You know, and I know it it's not you. I'm speaking from me. And the truth is, is, you know, whatever. It was a very close friend of our family and we're dealing with that and we'll do what we feel yeah. right in when our it's time. right yeah. yeah and everyone's different everyone's it's, different you know? know so i had did a video for um for um for forest right yeah and just someone just I, said that right? i got caught up with you know again like hey when you're going to do something this is yeah. the same thing towards you right yeah. and i kept mine very simple and very short just because like forest was a friend of mine yeah we saw each other from shows i spent some time sure. with you you know yep. and yeah. i even said like in my vlog i'm like you know what i feel you know there's people that are really close like you know brian barchick was a really really good friend yeah. of him but you know what i kept this up when i said hey guys you know what this is what i could share from my experience that i have with forest and i closed it out and i did it really good yeah. but i've noticed so much people like there's here, here's a funny story this has something to do with 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 um with it has something to do with forest but not really so there's People now that I see jumping on the bandwagon about like, oh, so-and-so that right? There's this friend of ours that, you know, I swear, this guy would never post anything. You know, yeah. I'm just talking about just a, a friend of ours, like back where I live. Sure. The minute someone would die, it's yeah. like, boom, this oh, guy was best yeah. friends with them. He had pictures, <laughs> not even the yeah. picture they even owned with them and just put it out there just for the attention. It's kind of like, we started making this joke. I'm like, this guy honestly like loves when someone dies. It's right? his only post. Yeah. And, like, and well, again, yeah. again, it brings a lot of attraction. It brings stuff yeah. like that. You know? Well, that was the thing. It's like, I didn't want it to ever be about me. You know, I mean, I don't want to draw attention to, to, to help me. You know, I want, I, I, it's um see you know, like like well like, you know you're still processing yeah because like Forrest yeah. was a friend of mine you know? which i call like a, a friend yeah. of like you know we talk here and there we see each other at shows and then there's that that's a friendship right but then you have like family friends yeah Forrest was like a legit family friend of your guys yeah. man i mean yeah no i mean he's 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 like a brother in, in 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 a lot of ways and it's it's tough man i mean you know i talked to desiree today um and uh it's it's something that it's going to take time for me. I mean, it, it's obviously, it's never, you know, listen, it's it's not just going to take time for me to get to the point where I can talk about it without wanting to cry, but it's going to take a lifetime. You know I mean? Yeah. There's, there's never going to be a day that I look back and don't miss him. You know what I mean? Uh, 30 years from now, I'll still think about him, you know? And, and, um, and that's just the way it is. I mean, and it's hard. And, and I, w so number one, I'm not emotionally ready to, to, to do a video about it because I want it to be, uh, and, and, and number two, I, I want it to be not about me, number one, and, 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 and more importantly, very helpful for Desiree and Lars, yeah. you know? Yeah. Um, and, and I want to have a, 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 the last thing Desiree right now needs is me, for me asking her anything, right? And like, when I asked her today, I go, how are you doing? And she said, terrible. I was like, of course you're doing terrible. It's a stupid question. Yeah. I shouldn't have asked you how you're doing. You know what I mean? Of course you're doing terrible. Um, so at, at some point, you know, I'd like to ask her what I can do for her. You know I mean? What can we do to help? You know, the community has been great. Obviously the NARBC yeah, yeah. stepping up, yeah. everyone else has been great. Uh, I just, I just want to make sure that I'm doing it the best I can possibly do for, for her and Lars. And, um, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's going to be tough, but I'll do it in my time. It'll be yeah. soon, but it's, it's not going to be this week. And, <laughs> and, it, and, and you know what? Yeah. And it doesn't matter, man. When you're ready, you're ready. And you yeah. know, people just, yeah. you know, need a, yeah, we, and it's I mean, fine. we could, we could let Lori let, let yeah, <laughs> Lori. I'll, I'll, I'll I mean, if you want the real them. version of it, you know. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and, no, it's, yeah. and, it's, and you like got a question? Said. Ask me. I'll <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'll tell you. You yeah. know, sometimes like it's funny. You're like, we'll, we'll get into. It. I'll get these messages and stuff like that. And then Tina's like, "Can I reply to them?" I'm like, "No." Nope. Yeah, no. Yeah, don't. don't <laughs> no. Do it, yeah, no turtle. Do not reply, please. Yeah. Like we still have to. You know, be somewhat nice. It's like, <laughs> what is do uh? You, how do you pronounce Acer? Is that it? I got yeah. you, bro. Acer Ramos. Acer Ramos. 
Acer Ramos, sorry, Probably. Daylight Savings Time, missed the whole podcast. Dude, well, I'm not going to lie, one, today man. is Wednesday, and that happened on Sunday, so yeah. what the fuck have yeah. you been doing for <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wait a minute. <laughs> yeah. Not yeah. sure where you're at, but... Well, you know, he might be He might be in a place that doesn't change, though. You know what I mean? He might be... Oh, okay. is he in the Philippines? So. Oh, yeah. Oh, so, so, okay. oh yeah. Lori, I just piggybacked off of your shit. Yeah, so yeah, listen, you're... Acer, Acer, sorry, man. Sorry for your being attacked. See? You know, listen, <laughs> listen, I really wanted to go. Totally jumped on, get him. <laughs> I really wanted to go to the Philippines in May for uh, a, a show. I was invited you, out there for a show. Are you going to do that? Are we? No. I, do you want to go? <laughs> if you go, I go. Really? Tina, say something. Oh. What's in the Philippines? Are you going to do that? <laughs> like, that takes over. That takes precedence over uh, Christopher's the homie. No, it's the end of May, not the beginning of May. Okay. Don't, don't look at me oh, that way. Right. You... <laughs> wait, wait, wait. The beginning of May? Yeah. The beginning yeah. of I can't, the beginning. No, it's the beginning. The beginning it's the of, end May of May. Oh, it's our May. wine trip. Oh, beginning yeah. of May is my son's birthday. And, and uh, our daughter's, yeah, yeah. which we do the wine trip for. Yeah, so. yeah. So that's, it stinks because. <laughs> I'll my, go to the wine friends, trip with you guys. Yeah, I love wine. Okay. <laughs> Heidi and uh, Arno from South Africa always want us to come over. Only Heidi, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Dude, oh, yeah, I Heidi, love yeah, her, man. She is so cool. Yeah, there's Heidi. Yeah, so I love So it sucks because they're. Their expo, which I've been to, which is amazing, by the, the one way. The one you want to take me to? Or the one that yeah, I got scared uh, to and backed yeah, out? Yeah, you backed out. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> but now so, we'll ever go after your story. So they're, unfortunately, <laughs> they're, know, uh, right? their show is always on the weekend that the wine thing is, you know, my daughter's birthday. Yeah, so and move it, it Heidi. Because, yeah, Heidi. Don't make it the first I, weekend I think, of May. <laughs> but I think Heidi actually said they're having another one in like November or December. So we should go. Yeah, I'm birthday, November, November, December. Yeah, and the thing that's nice is. Better not be the first week of November. Yeah, don't make it Noah's birthday because you're going to be in Vegas. Oh, it's going to be in Vegas. Be in Vegas. So I Heidi, mean, we'll be Heidi, you. tell me what uh, date that is, bro. Me and like me and Vegas, bro. Like I'm there. Like <laughs> okay, just good. us two. Is Tina no, gonna be there? No, dude. Too? It's gonna be a whole bunch. <laughs> Lori, <of> Lori. <laughs> hey, I'm trying to help a girl out. Wait, look, look. look. Do you want <laughs> do you sober have, do Miguel you got, or do you wait. want like fun time Miguel? I don't know. I kind of yeah, yeah. want to meet Turtle's got to stay. <laughs> right? <I> told you. <laughs> Turtle's got to stay. Tell you. This He's is Vegas it. time. Yeah. Maybe we're Dude, not no. trying to have any whips. You see my stories in Vegas. <laughs> you know I don't play around listen, in Vegas. Listen, listen. Miguel's coming to Vegas. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Period. I'm but sorry, Tina Turtle. I love you. Nah, but, she could come too. But yeah, you can come too. But uh, but Miguel's She can hang out with me and you can go do your Yeah. You do not want to leave these guys with me. Yeah. So Christopher said. Christopher's a Homie. Hey, uh, it's guys like you and Miguel that uh, inspire me to really get my business running. Hard work pays off. Uh, I'm all about uh, the biggest, uh, ha about to have the biggest baby season yet. Oh, that's so awesome. keep going, man. I mean, just keep going. Congrats, keep, man. Yeah, Thanks, congrats. And, and, and yeah, yes, we sir. appreciate you, Penny. Someone tried to expose Brian for dirty enclosures and looked like a joke <laughs> all over you again. <laughs> yeah, Hashtag exactly. get lost. Well, nice, I love it what happens. Nice and then, then, that, Penny. Yeah, and then uh, <laughs> Sherry Lynn said, uh, uh, grieving is personal. People are not robots. Exactly. Um, Yep. You know, and you're right. Like, uh, it's funny because people will take She just straight... told me, hush puppy, turtle. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Hey, turtle. <laughs> just so you know, I could have cursed. <laughs> Watch this. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, um... Shut the fuck up, Miguel. Wait, wait. Oh, 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 look at that. <laughs> Heidi <laughs> says 7th and 8th of November. Can't go. Oh, oh no. That's yeah. literally why, my Heidi, birthday why weekend. Why do you put your shows on both of my kids' birthday weekends? Yes. Literally. Like, ser seriously. Damn. 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 Figure this shit Heidi, out. I'll be there. <laughs> Damn, Lori. Yeah, dude, she's getting mad over What's that there. What's called? What's that called? Turtle the loves the Walking world. Dead. The Walking Dead. This Damn. is a gift. Oh, that's this is just, a gift. She's getting angry from someone, and yeah. actually, it's pretty. She's turn into a fucking zombie, dude. Yeah, she's this is like. Bite your head off. Like, yeah. Is the camera right there? No. Right you can't. Yeah. <laughs> Turtle, screenshot this. Yeah, Order yeah. some. Yeah. Order some. After. After three glasses, you'll literally be like the Walking Dead. <laughs> yeah, Walking Dead. But, uh, there you go. <laughs> um, you have to yeah. fill it up to the bad day line too. Mm -hmm. So let's take a few questions uh, and 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 see what's going on here. Uh, let's see uh, what we got. Move their birthdays. Sorry. Yeah, move <laughs> yes. their birthdays. Uh, I'm with you, Heidi. Hey, Heidi. Heidi, I'm with uh, you. That can happen. Sherry Lynn, really? Woo Turtle? <laughs> nah. What, Who says my... your son is Taurus Miguel? What? what? Yeah, he's May 1st, my son, Ace. Uh, yeah, oh, he's a Taurus. Jade's is a second. Oh, you have a oh, son? Really? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah Ace. You're my son. <laughs> 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 Noah's going to be in Vegas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. So uh, Noah's going to be in Vegas. Do you know what, real quick? Can I say something real quick? You know what? Oh, my God. It just bugs me. Uh -oh. So, for example, like, I'm cooler than Tina. 
Hands yeah. down. If oh, you put God, our influence, easy. like our numbers, I'm quoting Tina. You know, I, can't <laughs> I, can't, I can't agree because I don't know yet. <laughs> Wait, so I got Turtle's pretty okay. awesome. Turtle's pretty awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Like people do this thing. Hey, are you Tough. like team like uh like you know big dog or team turtle? Like I get demolished. I oh, can say yeah. anything on my vlog oh, yeah. and it's like always team turtle. Yeah. Do you get the same with Lori? Oh, no, always no, it's not it's not at all. It's just them being nice because it's your wife, right? And he's like the nicest guy ever. He is. So, no, no, he is. I know. No, but and listen, I'm a bitch. Listen, and no, I don't people, care. people love Lori. <laughs> people love Lori. People love Lori. And and people say that all the time. No. Can I put my yeah. two cents in? Go yeah. ahead. Hashtag Team Turtle, baby. What the fuck? Oh, oh, let's get that going, guys, yeah. in the chat. No, no, no. Hashtag no, no, either no, Team no, no, Turtle no, no, or no. Team Lori. No. Either one. No, no, uh, no, 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 hashtag no. Lori. Hashtag. Uh, oh. What is that, Miguel? Yeah. What is that reptile you don't have that you want to own uh, if you yeah. could? Oh, my gosh. Heidi, it's a King Cobra. I want oh, a King Cobra. Oh, man. That's we, so I want a King no, so good. I want dumb. a King Cobra so don't bad. Do that. Why? No, I can't have one in California. I just think they're the, I mean, it's a King. Pick something that's better. I have a black and indigo. So why can't okay, we see the kids uh, be on AEP's uh, channel anymore? Oh my gosh! Is Should I tell you about Papa? That? Is it oh, Papa? Is it they because took of like the eleven YouTube videos shit. from yeah. me, and I got remember? flagged on so many things. And yeah. I was like, so I remember uh, putting the kids on there all the time because my yeah. kids were always on my thing. Mm -hmm. Remember at one point, I mean, I don't get that much views on certain. I, I average like anywhere from five to eight thousand views, right? At this point, I was like, man, twelve hundred, fifteen hundred. I was like, dude, oh, this is like lower on my low. And then all my comments got turned down. I was like, oh wow. Wow. Yeah, YouTube did that. You know what's crazy though? Kids, yep. So so the Bram fam, all their comments got turned out. You know the Ace family? They're still good. Yeah, Ace family just uh they, yeah, yeah. They get yeah, they're getting a little crazy. uh I don't see, know, look there's at a team, lot of team Lori, Lori, Team, team Turtle. So, yeah, there's no right. team Brian's or Team Miguel's, man, or Team well, Noah even. Guess what? I'm yeah, like, are you serious? Is there a team? I am it's, all about this vlog or this uh vlog? not the vlog. I'm Lori, like, I'm like not the food. Hang on one second. Hashtag bitches. Hashtag bitches. <laughs> that? I, that's for me too. That's Mrs. So B. I'll take that. That's Mrs. B. Hashtag bitches. <laughs> oh, Dude, man. I swear, could we get like one hashtag like Team Miguel or Team Brian? No. Just one? No. Just one. Please? No. Never. Don't do it. No. Don't do it. <laughs> so Dude. Team Lori and Turtle. <laughs> Such, this is what I don't get. It bothers me so much. Dude. Dude, so uh, hey, there's a Team Brian. There's a Team Brian. Is it really? Yeah. Did you get a Team Brian? Oh, yeah, uh, what a kiss. Yeah, ass. because he asked oh. for it. I asked for it too. Yeah. 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 You, said, you said, can we get some Team Brian's, please? Oh, yeah. Oh, look, yeah. Team Brian. Yeah. Yeah. Team Brian. Go said, ahead, Noah. Ask for some. Yeah. Don't forget me, guys. Team Jay? Okay, this is bullshit. Team Jay. There's not one. one Miguel yet. Team <laughs> guys, Tina, I love you, babe. Do it, Team Miguel, please. Oh, no. Turtle, do Miguel. Jeez. Yeah. Turtle lovers, Team Guy. Oh, also. Team, oh, there we go. Team Miguel. Oh, there we go. Caps. You. There you go. Thank you, man. <laughs> Miguel, I'm not going to let you get off the hook, man. What was in that damn egg that I signed? Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah. What was it? Oh, then we have to talk to you about that though, that combo. <laughs> well, well, let's talk. Oh, is it is it a secret? Because you gotta send it to is Noah. Is it a secret or project? Or did you sell it already? I will tell you right now. It's a holdback. <laughs> ah, yeah. I'll show you a picture yes, of it. I'm getting a good you. one, baby. <laughs> All right, Chris. Chris, for two things. Uh, one, I'll definitely be at the Reptarium once my dad has back surgery. I hope your back surgery goes well. Uh, and then it's a uh, team. Team Laura and shameless plugs. <laughs> isn't it? Isn't Who the it, hell is Laura? <laughs> isn't it Tortuga? Tortuga. Tortuga. Tortuga? Yeah. It's Tortuga. with the I, isn't it with the O? Well, it just misspelled, but that's all right. I don't know. No, it's right. I am not sure Tortuga. because I don't know who the hell Laura is. I can't I even. Know. Oh, someone had it right. Anyways. All right. So, like, this is, the, this is the snake that actually was the one that uh that he signed all right okay, what is see it let me see first if, i'll tell you right now if your dad could guess the genes that are in it oh, it's yours can i, I will it send it back hey, it, uh, no one's made this oh then all i can't right. can no i see it? no that's yeah. not true all right let me see you oh might. my god that's beautiful yeah that is Let's dude see. so happy i have that <laughs> wait wait for noah, what? For noah guess it right. i can't guess oh, dad dad guess you won't guess it lord no mom don't guess don't ruin our freaking opportunity i mean it it you know it's obviously pied uh, it looks oh, like no it. No shit. <laughs> I thought it was a clown. <laughs> <laughs> so it's, Are you it, sure it's not a clown? To, to me, it looks like it. To me, it looks like it has you know lesser in it. Nope. No lesser. No lesser. All right. Does it? Uh, I don't know, then, man. I don't know. Cinnamon. I, I don't know. No. 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 no, 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 no. It's something cinnamon. that's light. I, I don't know if it's got it. orange dream in it. 
So it's got it's pied. It's well. Here's strain. the thing, though. Even though we, I could, I could tell you the pairing. And again, Blue it's never been skink. made. We don't know what's in it. Okay, tell so me what the pairing it, is. The oh, pairing God. is an orange dream, yellow belly, enchi gene X pied to a Mojave oh. pied. Oh, oh, the okay. But they've never sense. been. They've never really made any of those, though. No, that's interesting. It so definitely, really I got nice, off. Though. I got offered like forty five hundred dollars for it. And I was like, no, I'm just gonna keep it. You don't even yeah. know what it is. That's no, but problem. that's yeah. I'll keep it and see what you know what we do with it. Definitely, which reminds me, I'll take a baby out of it. Yeah, I'll give you that for okay. sure. Which yeah. reminds me of what I want to talk about is a, yeah. is a the um a uh, a pairing that I'm doing because of you, and Go I'm ahead. close Go to it. So hopefully in the next couple of months I'll start putting them together. What is it? So you know, obviously you know the sunset gene, right? Yeah. You were the first yeah. one that you know brought it in and stuff yeah. like. You know what's crazy? When I started my YouTube channel, I screenshotted some because that was my favorite snake. Yeah. From um. Yeah, because you from, like orange. Yep. Yeah, from the sunset, I just Googled it, and there was these pictures in the that were just all over the website. <laughs> they were Aaron's. <laughs> yes, they were your guys. The one with the black, and you can yeah, see the yeah. damn. Yeah. Best, Aaron Jones. <laughs> I swear, best pictures I've ever seen. Yeah. Yeah. So I would always put that on my outro or in my intro, even on, like, my other, my old Mac, I still have that on my screensaver, right? <laughs> so I was, you know, just a big fan of it. I remember when I first started getting into it, you know, I knew I wasn't going to catch up to all, like, the, the people making the sunset combos and stuff yeah. like that. And I had a lot of albinos. And I remember you told me, hey, uh, do you remember this? Do you remember this? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. So you're like, hey, you know, uh, the sunset you. is kind of like the, the, blood, the blood ball. ball. The blood, blood ball, right? Ball, yep. And then they put it to the T, that was a T uh, minus, the T. With the albino, the boa, the what, well, what they, is did, it? they did they uh, did both T negative and T positive yeah, boas, t yeah. And but then um, like, yeah. and they made the red the red red dragon the red dragon yeah. right. And yeah. you were and you remember you were telling me like, I think that's the ball python version of the boas on it. Yeah, exactly. So you know, I right away I did that, and obviously yeah. now I remember the, you produced the clutch. Yeah. You had a bunch of females, right? Dude, I have right now. I have seven. I have five uh, double head albino sunsets. Two uh, cinnamon. I'll buy uh, I'll, a double head albino sunsets wow. and have two males right now. And the females are around like around 800 grams yeah. and the, the males are around like 400 grams. Oh, so they're so just, I, it is true. So, so interestingly enough, when it comes to, to reptiles, which is, I find fascinating by the way, is that you can see the same mutation across all things, including lizards, snakes, and everything. Whether it's white-sided, uh, like you said, the blood boas. Uh, I, I really do believe the blood boas and the sunset is the same gene, yeah. just one in boas. Well, and I one started in looking at it, and they're honestly very, 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 very similar. similar. Yeah, and then. So you get that albino in there and uh, and and you might have to mix like some hypo or you know something like that because I think <laughs> yeah I know Noah's like uh, but. Well, honestly this is one pairing that I'm so, and again the, talking about the um I don't know if you could I mean this will be a good question for you kind of, well not kind of a question but yeah Man, Laura, you're, I love you. You're way cooler, Brian. You don't wear New Balances. Yeah, hell yeah. I That's am. what I'm talking about. Yeah. So, um, real quick. I never uh, wore the New Balance. You, Go ahead. <laughs> you, see, I mean, honest, tell me if you agree with this. Go ahead. Have you noticed in, in, in your years when you were breeding ball pythons and mm -hmm. a lot of breeders, do you ever felt that a lot of people felt like if it was erased, like right away, and instead of holding things back, <clears throat> they were selling things like their oh, breast yeah. stuff right away yeah. to make that quick buck. Yeah, right? that's, how, that's what happens. I noticed that the first year of you know people doing this, and I've noticed you know again he's never been that yeah. guy. Yeah, no. he so, always wants to hold what, everything yeah. back. What I don't understand is a lot of people no. tell me right now, oh well, you came in with a lot of money to invest in this and that. Yes, I did, and I just talked about it recently how much yeah. I invested in this, and yeah. it wasn't as much as other people have invested. Right, the only sure. difference is that I put myself in 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 the in the camera to talk sure. about it. That's the only sure. difference. Yeah. Right. But um, I've done these these combos, these morphs, and these new worlds first stuff, and I'm like, how did I do these when people have had these genes for like five, seven years? Because you hung on to stuff. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So I started, you know, like really, really doing, it. and and that's what I've noticed big time on this. You know, it's like in the business side of it, it's not. You know, if you make something really, really cool, you hold that back and then make, you know, that. Yeah. Even cool. Well, I think, you know, like Justin Cabela, he's, he, he's like the master yeah. of like hanging on to the right genes and not and, and, and seeing the project through. And what so works and what doesn't work. Right. Too. Yeah. And, and he's really good about selling ingredients, but not the end product. Yeah. You know, so mm -hmm. he's always one. He, he's smart, smart about keeping one step ahead of everybody else. You know, he's going to sell you everything shy of the one gene smart. that you need. Smart. Yeah. To make. You know, stuff. And that's, that's, that's how I've always, I, I was always the same way. You know, I kept things and, and, and yeah. <laughs> you had to do that one though. Yeah. So but, what yeah. I did, what I did with the sunset one, right? I knew I had a couple of head sunsets yeah. in there, but I knew I wasn't going to catch up to it. And this was honestly like, I remember I, I I'll tell you right now, I paid $15,000 for my mail, right? Yep. 
And I was like, man, I'm not going to catch up to make these hats. But I had a lot of female shelved as far as the clowns, pies, yeah. desert ghosts, albinos. And I threw them to all of those, dude. And then people were like, even, like even Justin, even, you know, a couple of people that they were purchasing these double hats here and there. But I would keep the, you know, the, yeah. the higher combo and stuff like that. And I made my initial investment like sure. way quicker than any, than I would have with yeah. any visual. Yeah. Just off of double hats. Sure. You know, and, 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 and I'm starting to kind of really see, and I'm trying to, you know, like tell people, man, it's the patience in this industry. Yeah. Is a game changer. Man. Well, That's with I, life, though. Yeah, patience. Yeah, it is true. Is such yeah. a key to yeah prosperity. Right. Yeah. Damn! Cheers. So you damn fortune cookie. Yeah. So, <laughs> you damn fortune cookie? Whoa! Oh, shit. Whoa! That walking zombie's no joke. Wait, don't ask. Oh, I like that a lot. I have one like that, but it's the coffee, and towards the someone end, it's like I'm in the that, restaurant. Um, <laughs> someone said that it's actually two weeks till the clocks go forward wherever John Phillips is from. So I don't know where the hell you uh, are. But, but no, I mean, there's a lot of places. <laughs> I think that, I think oh, shout out to there. Going Uper. <sighs> going Uper's in there. I, hey, what's up, Going hey, Uper? Hey, is up. We love the Upers <laughs> no, here. Just, Jay was just up in the UP. So yeah, these guys, deeper. people are like, oh, not feeling well. No, no, it's falling asleep. No, no, I don't know what the fuck they're talking about. This is boring. Yeah, yeah once sorry, you get I, into, I, I don't, don't want to talk the about the whole rap. It's to no. me, it's just yeah. stuff that I wanted to ask you. Know, it's no, I think that's cool. You you know? Know? I mean, um, people, uh, these people know what you're talking about, but I'm literally what's no. up with the Lori Ball out of the loop. I don't know. Do you have any of that? I try to get. Actually, I've been trying to get some snacks from you guys for quite some time. Yeah, it actually is a treat. We're gonna ship. We're gonna have Miguel pack a shipment and ship it to it. I will. If you that, talk right, to right, me, right, yeah, right. get the shit. And you know what? I will back you up on this. I'll defend you on this. you even have my number? Uh, yes. Actually, she told me. She goes, hey, <laughs> we're supposed to ship out these snakes. Tell me when they're ready. And I'm like, oh, I talked to Brian. She goes, no. Don't <laughs> talk, talk to, to me, me if you want your snakes. And I was like, I tell and I never replied right. back. You're right. You're right. I tell I people that all the time. I'm just, that's no. why I don't that's want right. to have anything to do with that's the right. HP sales side of things. Damn. Right here. Yeah, Lori takes care of it. And guess what? I'm going to get that shit out, so... Talk All to right. Me. Well, we'll pack it up tomorrow and <laughs> ship it to Turtle. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, I want to be there. I get it for the content. You know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, it boring, bro. <laughs> <laughs> no one cares about the genetic shit. <laughs> sorry, sorry, Pitbull. We won't talk about. We won't talk about. Talk, about, talk about Daddy Long Neck. What is that? What? That's that dude that sat next to me at the. Oh, the uh, daddy, yeah, the, yeah, that the, the guy from. <laughs> I actually saw him on on TikTok the he's other day. Yeah, up, yeah. Dude. He's a he's a skinny dude, man. Whoa, Whoa long Daddy. Long yeah, yeah. 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 Long, like his arms don't move right, dude. Like he tries to yeah, like, he looks like a like, yeah. it's like fucking it's fucked Yeah, he up. looks like he looks like yeah, like dude, some kind of he's from like Flint. Flint. It's from Flint, so it's all that oh, fucking it's water. It's that rusty it's that water, water boy. It's, uh, someone said hey from Queensland, Australia. Uh, Miguel, let's yeah. go to freaking Queensland. Does Brian own Jimmy Miguel said, a baby by oh. oh man. Well, you know, the good news about that, any? the people that don't or listen. Do listen, 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 listen. This is good. The the I deal is is that this. Yeah, so he sent us the one obviously it had one baby. Might have had more, but they were gone. <laughs> they I have no got idea. Out, but, and um, we don't know. <laughs> But then you had a, a litter a few weeks, a couple of weeks later yeah. of really nice ones. So yeah, that was seven awesome. of them. Seven. So there's okay. how much I have now. How many? None. <laughs> Three. Three. What happened? Okay. Dude, I tried everything. They don't eat. They don't you eat know, food. I yeah, tell you what, hard, those are Dude. like the Solomon Island boas. They're so hard. Well, they're the same. Yeah. St. Yeah. Jesus. I was, yeah. I was like yeah. researching and everyone has their like tricks yeah. and they say this, they say that. Yeah. I tried every single one. And you know, the only ones that, that, that took are the ones that took from the beginning. Yeah, that that's, was it. A lot of those candoya yeah. are it. like that. Like if they do well, they do well. If they don't do well, you almost yeah, just have to exactly. let them go, you know? And it's a little bit of a difficult thing. But uh, someone said, hey, from Queensland. So uh, we should go to Australia. I want to go to Australia. Why don't we oh do my that? god, uh, Costco's in Australia right now, man. I, Holly, yeah, I think I think they're on their way back. Says, hey now. Miguel, see you Saturday. Wants to get a picture with your guns. Oh, girl, I with got your you. Guns. Dang. Oh, that. they're little guns. Now those are guns. <laughs> These used to be guns. That, oh my god, I just cramped. <laughs> Did you just break a rib? No, I cramped. <laughs> Dude, I haven't worked out for years. So uh, oh. let's see. Uh, how many wax worms should I feed a gecko a day? Actually, I don't know. It you really don't want a gecko. Well, yeah, they no, kind of like actually, a little dessert you know, for them, right? Like, yeah, you don't yeah. want to feed wax worms as a as a whole to your gecko. It's it's like something you might want to do once a week at the very most, every ten days at the most. You want to feed, uh, depending on the gecko, you feed, uh, you know, superworms, mealworms, crickets, depending on the gecko. But you never want uh, wax worms to be the staple diet. 
Let's see, uh, what advice do you recommend to start a YouTube channel? My advice, honestly, is starting a YouTube channel is just start it. I was gonna say, just do it. Just start I, it. It's will will it just, be successful? It's hard to say. Yeah. You know, I mean, maybe yes, maybe no. But it, <laughs> it, it's oh, it's not going to be successful if you don't Here's start. One. How did you learn to trust Noah to do his own things as he got older? I have three kids, four years and under. Any advice? Okay. Well, your kids are super young, so yeah. don't trust anything for yeah. a long time. <laughs> <laughs> Number one. <laughs> <laughs> Noah is 20 plus and uh, it took a long time. So no, I would say don't trust your kids to their own devices for a very long time. Yeah, you know what about the, you? No, don't trust them. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> yeah. exactly. No, so they enough. have to earn that trust. You'll you know, figure it, it out when it comes. And we uh, actually uh, yeah. took, um, you know, um, and actually, you know, this is something actually pretty cool that I would actually love to talk about. Um, it's like with the whole bowling thing. I've never thought of experiences with my kids. Wow, man, you want to talk about some real stuff? So we get a call from the the principal. Turt, I hope you're okay with this. And even if you weren't, I'm okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm here we go. <laughs> I already started cracking. <laughs> no, you want you want to talk about something like really real. It's funny. It happened the day, uh, you know, what's it called? Uh, um, oh, my gosh. What's the name from FaZe Rug? Yeah. This whole thing about the bullying thing. Yeah. And you always hear these things and you always think about it. I mean, I mean. You never really think it's going to be with your kids and stuff like that. What are you talking about? Bowling. Bullying. Bully. Oh, bullying. Bully. Yeah, yeah. So okay. I thought my you said accent, bowling. My what the fuck's and, going on with bowling? Oh, bullying. <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> it was crazy. So we get a call okay. from the principal saying, you know, there's this stuff going on with your daughter and all these kids. Blah, blah, blah. We're like, yeah, whatever. So we get So there. was she the bully? Check this out. And I'm not even, I'm not even trying to even like defend my kid in any way. Yeah. But no, she wasn't. Okay. Wow. I mean, kids are so vicious, dude. I mean, you know, we yeah. want to talk about like, why we took our social media out, you know, and everything. Yeah. Um, so anyways, these kids are going back and forth saying some stuff. They accused her of these things. And the thing is, like, you know, if you mirror your chat, your kids thing, you could go through all the stuff that's oh, way yeah. back. Yeah. So we're going through everything. And these kids are vicious, dude. They screenshot these, you know, pictures of my daughter, you know, at the age when she was like five years old. She was really, really big. And they're just calling her yeah. oh, these horrible. names. That's crazy, though. But it, it gets to a point where you know, even the cops get involved. And I mean, oh. it gets so yeah. bad and stuff like that. But the whole thing is in this, the, what <clears throat> the teacher is telling us is, you know, like, well, my daughter's not saying anything bad. She's like, well, if you want to have a problem, my daughter goes, just fight me. Is when right. my daughter said, like, yeah. don't. And I'm not even trying to brag, but she's saying, like, on the things, you're calling her words I don't even want to say on here. You know, sure. you're talking about 11, 12-year-old kids. Yeah. And my daughter goes, oh, you want to fight? Just, you know, just do it if you blah, 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 this, this, and that. Yeah. But at the end of the day, though, what happens is, you know. I'm sorry, but. Yeah, to your daughter, because I'm not going to lie, that's exactly what I told my kids. Well, guess like, what you happened stand afterwards? Your ground, and if somebody says something, then yeah, call them out and kick so, their ass. Exactly. So there was a group of, a group of girls. <laughs> exactly. That's the way I think. A group of girls telling her my daughter this. So what happens at the end of the day, she ends up doing something about it, right? Mm -hmm. And then she gets in trouble about it. And I guess yeah. what they had, what they were saying my daughter to do, she should have filled out a report. It's like, Screw who the hell that. fools yeah, out a report that, or go nope. to the buddy bench? That's yeah. literally what, you the, know what the only two things. Fuck your buddy bench because yes. I'm sorry. Can I say that too? I mean, yeah. Fuck, yeah. Yeah. Fuck, say it. fuck the body fuck bench buddy because bench. I'm sorry. I know today is so politically correct with all this shit. Oh my I'm God. Sorry. Lori, I love that's, you. That's what I told like, my kids. If somebody is talking shit or doing shit to you, you call them out. And when the principal takes you down, you tell them to call me because I will oh. have your back. And I will say, yes, I told my kid to stand up for themselves and kick the ass Whew. because fuck all this oh, other turtle. stupid shit. Yes. I'm sorry. Even, even Tina agree with us. Say yes. So I told, I told that's Aubrey. what I said. I'm like, she goes, what if the teacher said, I'm like, I don't give a fuck what exactly. your teacher says. They could deal with me. Tell them to call me. me. Yeah. Tell them to call me and I'll tell you yes. Yeah. That's but, what I told them to do. Back, you know, to, <laughs> back to what Noah though. Like you know Noah what? is a good kid though. Because even like the people that were hanging out with us, even my brother-in-law, they're just like, how old is he? And I was like, oh, you know, he's like... 19. Well, I'm not going to say because that we're doing, but uh, 21, <laughs> 21. <laughs> no, oh, but boy. just this whole like, his whole yeah. like, he's he, honestly, he's a good kid. I couldn't tell you, how, I don't know that many people that have kids his age that they would trust him going out different places. I mean, he's not your regular 20 or 19 year old. I'll tell you right now, you know, and that, that's cool. It's just the way you guys raised him. It shows, you know. Well, thank I you. Raised and I raised myself. No, I'm no, just kidding. Yeah. He was actually, sure he was actually raised by me. I would say, big shout out to Laurie. <laughs> raising. Yes. Hell yeah. Because yeah. you don't yes, have new yeah. balances. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> he's actually raised by wolves. No, big, <laughs> no, it's definitely a big part of my mom. For sure. <laughs> like, no, no, we even were just you're... talking about that. How I always told you and Jade, like you stand up for yourself, and you know, I'm be I got your back. Like if but somebody is messing just, with you and doing stuff, it's weird because you know, you, I don't know. You you taught me some like unconventional things, but like they worked out. You know, like it's 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 yeah. it's. I can't even explain it because 
the way that you teach stuff is like very different than literally every other mom. <laughs> Yeah. But it just kind of like, see that. It, but it, it, <laughs> but it, it made me grow works. up faster it and works. like kind of understand the world more. Well, I think it was simple, right? She always said he was raised thing. by Lucy. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, well, Lori <laughs> always said one simple thing, you know, every action is going to have a consequence. It has to, Yeah. you know, yeah. and so you yeah. have to, you have to be willing you to have face to the consequence with, of your actions. Exactly. You know, what's crazy. Cause my daughter wasn't yeah. really worried about all the stuff that we're saying. When I told her, like, hey, you have to, there's going to be a point, like, you know, if these people are getting, going out of their way and making a group chat to, like, dog you, no. there's only going to be one way they're going to respect you or you're going to learn yeah. something. Yeah. But her worry was more like the teachers, this and this and that. And oh, dude, yeah. they don't matter. It, it, it doesn't make It's so nope. weird, man. And that's exactly it's what I said. Thing, yeah. You know what? If they call you in, you call me. And you know, I will 100% I go, say, I tell Aubrey, I told you. I'm like, hey, I'm going to go in there and I'm going to look a little upset, but afterwards we'll like go hang out. And exactly. Be like, yeah, girl, I got exactly. you. you know? 100%. You know, that's exactly it. Well, we and, yep. and it happened. We went in <laughs> there, we grabbed her, we went outside yeah. and we went out to eat. If you did the right thing. And I asked her. Not if you didn't yeah. do the right thing. And then I said, yeah. did you throw the left first or the overhand right? Which one no. landed? Yeah, which no, one landed. No, I'm, I'm not saying it's a good thing to do, but when it gets to the point where if you, as a parent, if you really see the stuff that was said about your yeah. daughter yeah. at this point honestly my first thought was like could i meet their parents so i could beat the crap out of them that was oh, my honest my first God. thought you, know? you don't even know because 100 percent. that's what i think it was like ugh. i totally i can't beat the shit out of these kids but yeah i can beat the shit and that out was of my that was my first thought assholes yeah. because <laughs> what the hell dude why are, why are we more like closer friends i don't know right, right, yeah. i don't know dude, i know <laughs> I know, me and Turtle you are know more alike. Yeah, you and way Laurie more alike. Like, yeah. I say the buddy bench is for bitches. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Can I say you that too? No, the you can't say that. <laughs> I can say that. I don't have kids. <laughs> I'm just like, oh my no, God. but for I think these kids too soft, man. Well, you know, and that's and that was go my get goal. Your, go like, get your feet wet. I go I play was, in a puddle. <laughs> that, you know what? Okay, so, was, so you know, I was not yeah. a bully. I was not someone that ever picked on anybody or anything really? like that. No, but you know what? I stood up. I stood up for myself and I stood up for people who yeah. did get picked on. You know what I mean? Yeah. If I saw something, then I would pull in there and I would be like, no, you know, you don't pick on this person for this or that. You don't fuck with my brother. Obviously nobody fuck with me, but. You know, <laughs> Obviously. Yeah, but, I see that. Yeah. But you know what? That was the thing. I wasn't a bully. I didn't pick people Neither. out, but I did st always stand up for people. And that's the whole thing. And that's what I told my kids. Don't take shit from anybody. If anybody is, you know, trying to, you know, talk bad you on know, you or making you feel bad or picking on you. You stand up for yourself. 100% agree on that. Yeah. And I don't, you know, I've never really bullied anyone. The only person, but it's just something about them, is Carrie from KB Reptiles. Yeah, just, she's horrible. Gosh, she's a horrible no. person. I like her. I know. Fuck you. No. We're what? fighting what? after. We're just, <laughs> we're we're standing just, up for no. Carrie. Carrie's Carrie. cool. I'm beating his ass for you. Carrie's cool. For Carrie, you, Carrie. Carrie. cool. Carrie and Barrels are the worst people no, on no, the planet. No. Dude, Barrels, I love. Dude, he got stomped on by yeah. a freaking cow. I like uh, them. Yeah. Without oh a cow, a bull. They have, you know. That they beard, though, you know. That dude, beard, yeah. though. They barrels have, are um, cool people. I love <laughs> they them. Are, they are good They're people, supposed though. to they bring are. me ketchup chips that I heard in oh, Canada. They're, they're so good. good. You it's haven't had good. those? I've never had them. Had Everyone them talks about them. Let me them. reiterate. I like them. Because, <laughs> no, I do. I like barrels, too. I love Carrie, barrels. Carrie. Because I love barrels. Are you like barrels or ketchup chips? No, okay, yeah, okay. <laughs> so I like the people. Oh, okay. Got I, the Canadian they got, people. Exactly, yes. Be the people of Canada. Every time they're around, you know, the they have, they like smile and stuff. Yeah. They have, they have friendly smiles. They're so they nice, they're nice, man. No, no, honestly, they're they're just great, great people. You man. know, hey, yeah. everything hey? is awesome. Yeah, or they say, hey, I'm going to go host? out and about. <laughs> it's like, wait, what'd you say? About? A boot. It's a boot. It's a boot, right? Or boot. It's a boot, eh? Uh, that's <sighs> awesome. Well, guys, uh, I, there was one more thing. I, someone just said, kick some ass. Uh, whoever, <laughs> that, whoever that was, God bless you for that. Uh, oh, Aaron. Uh, Aaron. Oh, yeah, Aaron. Kick Big the, shout out kick to Aaron. Aaron. Kick the ass. Kick the ass. It's good for you. So, uh, Miguel, thank you for coming on, dude. Yes. It's been awesome. We're going to hang out uh, tomorrow, film oh, some definitely. stuff in Spanish. Oh, a lot of filming, yeah. El Spanish. Spanish, yeah. And yep, Serpente. English. Um, <laughs> El Serpente. Serpente. No one. You no one said El in there before. El Spanish. El, yeah. he, said, he said El, El Spanish. <laughs> El Spanish. It's like, yes. <laughs> you're right. No, no. you're white. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're going to have some fun with that. 
that. Uh, obviously, uh, oh, we'll put the link in the description to all of uh, Miguel's yes. stuff. Go yeah. show him some love. Uh, one of our dearest friends, obviously. So uh, cool. Well, that's it, guys. Yes. Uh, you guys good? Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you like the freaky podcast. Amen. You guys yes. have been checked in, and we are checking, checking out. out. Checking Peace. Out, man. Peace, guys. Good job, guys. It was fun stuff, man.